I'm one and oh. <laughs> I kill gameplay. God, then leave and in out. That is not a painting, and it definitely looks like it could fall on my head. Okay, I guess this will work. Hello and welcome to the Duo Drop-In presented by Call of Duty Mobile. I will be your host, Maven, for this incredible day of Call of Duty action. I'm going to be joined by two terrific content creators for Call of Duty Mobile. We've got Ferg, we've got Kyle, and I want to introduce the boys first off. Ferg, tell me a little bit about yourself, pal. Hey everyone, you may know me from my main channel content where I post Call of Duty Mobile super consistently, or you may have seen me on the official Call of Duty Mobile channel, but now you're getting to see me on the Call of Duty Mobile eSports channel. This is going to be awesome, man. I'm excited to yes, have sir. you. I, lo I love the energy, the passion, and uh, I know at one point you were number one on the leaderboards early in COD Mobile, so you're an absolute beast, and I'm ready for you to break down the gameplay. But on the other side of this, Kyle, I know you are a monster in the mobile BR space. Tell me a bit about yourself. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Kyle Official. I'm a Battle Royale content creator. I'm also a COD Mobile partner, so you may have also seen me on the COD Mobile YouTube channel, and I'm just excited to be making my debut here on the COD Mobile Esports channel. I'm excited to have you, man. This is going to be as we have fun time. I know, I know for you guys, it's a little bit different. I, I obviously, I mean, I've been hosting or commentating for like seven years. You guys are usually more on the content creation and YouTube side, but we're going to have some fun. We're going to, we're going to watch these incredible players go at it. And I want to talk a little bit about what we're going to be doing today with the duo drop in. So first and foremost, let's start to go through the format. We're going to take a look at this, how it's going to break down, how the points are going to be earned and, you know, some of the various restrictions that are going to go into this for at a high level. Can you take me through it? Yeah, sure thing, Maven. So straight off the bat, it's more focused on the points for kills slash frags. There's also going to be points for placement, however. I'll go through the placement points first. Straight off the bat, if you come in first, you're going to get 20. It drops down by 5 to 15 if you finish second. Then when you hit the third place spot, you're only going to be getting 12. After the third place spot, they go down by 2 the whole way down until ninth place, then ninth to 16th is zero points, goose egg land. When it comes to kills, it's gonna be three points for every kill. However, if you manage to get that first frag, either you or your duo teammate will be getting nine points, which is triple the original normal kill points. There's 16 teams total, a creator paired up with the pro player that they have chosen with five games. There are also some banned items, which I think will keep up the competitive integrity of this entire tournament. Things like the tank is gone, the purifier is gone, the war machine, and my personal favorite thing that is removed from this entire tournament, the trap master. It is gone. And I'm fairly excited. Yeah, lovely breakdown there, Ferg. Uh, kind of took us through it. And Kyle, from your POV, you know, with all your experience with Call of Duty uh, Mobile BR, uh, with those banned items, like how much is that going to change this? I think it's going to change it a lot because as Ferg says, it's going to keep up the competitive integrity. We're definitely going to see more skill-based action going on around here. And that's what the tournament is all about. So yeah, let's see it. Yeah, no, absolutely. I'm excited to see these guys go at it. I, again, the pro and content creator duo squads. Uh, now let's look at the prize pool and how this is going to break down. So you see it on your screen. First place, $6,000. And yes, uh, is there a lot of pride and trash talk and you know, a lot that goes into this. Yes, but you know, everyone, everyone's playing for the cash, which is important too. And you see at the top right there as well, the hot drop heroes, a thousand extra for the team with the most first frags and $500 extra for the first frag of each game. So not only are you getting those extra points, but you're also going to be earning some extra cash as well. And who doesn't like a little, a little gravy on top of maybe an overall placement inside of this tournament, but Let's continue to move on as we get ready for our first game to see these guys battle it out in the Call of Duty Mobile BR. I want to, I want to talk about these teams now. Um, Kyle, we'll start with you. When you take a look at this first page of teams, who stands out for you? Okay, Maven, I'm definitely seeing a lot of familiar faces. Shout out to the homies on team number three and team number four. But on team number six, which is Bobby's team, I'm seeing Sun. And Sun definitely has a lot of experience in the competitive side of Battle Royale. So I'm definitely looking forward to see him pop off in these games. Yeah, no, I'm looking forward to it because you know, some of these guys I'm really familiar with, some not as much, and I want to see what they can do. Uh, for, for page two, who do you like? 
Um, I'm going to be looking at Team 7 and Team 8 because they have two players that were actually on the Tribe Pro team that won the North Am American Regional Finals this year, this past year, for the uh, official Call of Duty Mobile Championship. Also, I'm looking over at Tatilo. I know that that guy's a really good multiplayer player, so it'll be interesting to see if he can also transform his skills over to the Battle Royale Arena. I saw a mod six. He's got a ball with a nice beard. Like I, I just know for experience that that <laughs> kind of guy. Huh? Oh, you, you ooze. It was absolute talent. But uh, Kyle, as we look at the final couple teams here, I guess I'm just curious because uh, you, you can't think of these guys have played a ton together. Maybe a little bit of prep. But when you have a pro and a content creator, and maybe not a lot of lead up into this, how difficult do you think maybe the communication aspect is going to be for them going in? Um, I think it's going to be, I think they're going to be fine. I think they got enough time maybe to practice and like just get to learn each other's skills and, you know, get to just warm up on that communication aspect. And hopefully they were able to get some teamwork going along and just execute that. Yeah, I'm curious just for my uh, esports experience. I, I, there are a lot of factors, you know, you have, you have the gun skill and positioning and all these different things, but communication, uh, it, it might be number one. It is <laughs> we'll key. see. <laughs> it's it's so important so so important i think it's uh, undervalued sometimes but it, it's gonna be awesome to see how it plays out and we're getting ready to go let's do this damn thing it's time to start it off we've got five games coming off let's get in to our first map all right boys i'm curious do you think with this format are we gonna see hot drops they're gonna be spread out what do you guys think well, I'm kind of hoping that there's going to be hot drops because of the kill incentives, like the first frag incentive being nine points. Hopefully we'll see some hot drops, but it is a tournament and there is 6,000 first place dollars up for grabs, $15,000 total. So I think some people may be playing kind of cautious. What do you think, Kyle? Yeah, I think they're not going to, a lot of these players are not going to just try to risk it, you know, because it's a, there's a lot at stake. So hopefully we do get some hot drops so it's going to be like really exciting, but let's just see what's going to happen. Well, I'm already jealous uh, because this spectator mode with the map and everything, I, I'm not used to some oh, yeah. of these tools. This is uh, this is really, really dope. All right, well, let's hop into some of the action we have going down right after the aerial cam as we see the fight starting to get going, boys. Tatilo's will he pick up the first frag? It looks like he did. The first one that I seen, at least. Oh, that's a 500 yeah, for that team. 500. Let's go. <laughs> and nine points for the first frag. It's looking like they're straight up in the lead straight away fantastic job dude right down to practice range as well i would not expect many teams to go down there but i believe team nine seven and ten are all around there but looking into the black market it's noah's team versus jim's team yeah he's dropping on us oh let's see what's gonna happen here we got some action is he gonna drop in what is he doing what's he doing i think jim's trying to shotgun from the sky i'm not really sure what the move was he got the knock though and the shoddy looks it looks very powerful i think we're gonna see a lot of shoddies in these games the shoddies are like op 100 percent, especially the hs0405 we were talking just before the game's begun saying how overpowered that shotgun is so if you're a new viewer to br keep your eye out for that particular shotgun yeah, with these games, you know, it kind of cycles, right? You have a strong weapon here, a strong weapon there. But yeah, you should probably find out what's uh, the powerful weapon to use. And we'll see over the course of this what they're rolling with. But so far, the shoddy's looking good. But you see using the 3P, but the grapple gets hit. He'll head up top as he'll look for another angle, try to find an opening. Oh, he gets a shotgun. He gets the 515. He's like, oh, slaying Jim. I know what popping off. Can he get the second though? Will he be able to get it? Will he be able to clutch the whole thing? He hits it at a second. Noah, Fantastic Noah's going crazy. <laughs> and it is eliminated as well as Jim. Uh, <laughs> Noah's one of the first people that I played COD Mobile with and I quickly realized how bad I was. Like, <laughs> no, dude, I, 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 like for the first time I'd ever played, I had to play this tournament and like, it was like Hawks and Noah and these guys. And I was like, okay, I am out yeah. of my depth right now. <laughs> we still have some action going on down here in practice range. Extremes already knocked. The 1v2 situation. My Hawk able to just pick up the kill quickly. The first fragger is out. <laughs> Using the ninja to his advantage, straight onto the rock, slayed out. There's nothing cooler than like a grapple gun play. There's nothing oh, yeah. better. Oh, Any yeah. game it's like ever been in, like hitting, hitting a good one. Oh, it feels so good. 100%. That also means that the people who got the first frag are already out of the game. They only got nine points total. Exactly. Well, but yeah, think about it. How many, with as limited players as it is, 
what, what do yeah. you think is going to be like a lot of kills like i, I mean a team getting if, i feel like if you get to like i don't know 10 or so that's probably really 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 good so if you get 10 kills that's a third of the lobby so you're fragging out i'd say like four kills and you're you're doing good yeah probably but that's why even if they're out early the fact they got that first kill is huge oh yeah oh yeah it's massive massive tournament lobby is is so good even when you have 100 people so if someone gets 10 kills <laughs> yeah. in these games that's crazy oh i make like 10 but 10 combined like for the team but oh for the team oh okay yeah 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 no no 10 10 for one person yeah <laughs> that you'd be you'd be going nuts it's possible i guess popping off oh it's gonna be a 2v1 situation it's, it's not looking it's oh gone. it's done no, <laughs> no chance envoy could have got out of that situation no cover no idea Looks like Moralto's over in the dance studio. Probably he's probably he's dancing in there. He's having a party. Yeah. <laughs> he just leaves his teammate to die. Nice, good job. They also got a Lodi drop right there as well. By the way, for the viewers, that yellow circle means that's where we're gonna transition to in the next screen. Alright, alright. Now we're we get the spit here shiny nose now as well. That's the good stuff. Look how far away he is from the zone, dude. Come on, Bobby! Bro! <laughs> it is smart play. He's got two adrenalines. He's chilling. And a helicopter. And that level three ar armor. And that level three armor, too. Yes, sir. Well, I think it was you, Kyle. You were pretty, I guess, amped about Sun. You really thought he was going to do solid in this. Like, is it just from you watching his gameplay over the past year? The like, guy's just nasty? I think just from watching his gameplay, and as I said, he competes in a lot of competitive like tournaments and stuff. So yeah. he, a lot he, of experience. Sh he, he should yeah, be one so of the most experienced players in these lobbies, 100%. along with these like clan members. Sun was in my uh, team, maybe you may not have watched it. It was a creator showdown around the year anniversary of the game, and he was popping off in, uh, in my team as well. And we actually won that whole thing. It was me, him, and a couple of his clan mates. And he's really, really good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I think we have a push going on here. Is he pushing two people? What is he doing? I don't know, dude. Lil B's got big ego, bro. He's looking for the ego challenges. Oh, he's going. He's going. <laughs> he wants anything that he can get. Anything at all. I think he scouted Aerith, and Lil B knows that Aerith isn't really too good in the BR setting. She's more of a multiplayer player. And that's the thing about this whole competition is all these content creators have seemed to team up with like professional Battle Royale players, but Lil B and Path are together and they're both multiplayer dominant players as they go up and fight Aerith. Slay her out. And now it's Lil B. Gonna get the double kill. Miney's down as well. Super quick. Super, super quick. You guys, you guys make a good point. Like it's, yep. it's, you know, it's all Call of Duty, and a lot of the skill will yep. transfer over. It's but it is, skill. it is a very different game at the it's same time. It's completely different. <laughs> yeah. it, Battle Royale and multiplayer are two separate games in my eyes. It's actually crazy that it's like that. Person element alone, like it's yeah, hundred percent. And the way the guns move and work, it's just it feels different to the touch. It's almost as if we do really have two different games inside of just one Call of Duty mobile app. Well, hundred percent. But that's what's made Call of Duty so special. You've got zombies and BR and multiplayer. Literally, it's like, yeah, like three games packed into one half the time. Yes, sir. Oh, Citrus got Ooh. killed. Yeah. It's all down to Noah. Just get out of there for Is Noah going to get that tag? Can Noah get that tag? It's mod six. Here's my He's got the player. OP shotgun. Here's my this is the shotgun player. we were talking about. Smoke him. Use that ball <laughs> beer to your power. Remember, he's gone. Okay. There's that helicopter at, at Harbor. That thing has so much health, bro. <laughs> There's no chance Mod6 was going to oh, blow that up. Oh, he still up. didn't get the tag yet. The yeah. Around? Are they going to allow the him to get the tag, though? He's looking rough on Noah. I'd go for it. I'd go for it if I was Noah. There's another team here, though. He needs to get it and go. Get it and go! Noah is going to get away with this, guys. I can't yeah. believe this. Fantastic. Team number, team number three is moving a little, a little scared there. <laughs> <laughs> they are they are i think maybe they thought that noah was in king gamer's team and that's why they left they thought it was a 2v2 when it was actually a 2v1v1 yeah yeah probably nice play yeah he gets the bertha he is out of there but yeah he's straight out just get the teammate in as fast as possible I, bobby oh, and son like... coming in though yeah they're still just flying around just getting yes, a nice, nice, nice view of the land at this point, I'd be looking for kills if I was Bobby. You're teamed up with one of the best Battle Royale players in the world. You need to be going for the frags as soon as possible. That's true. They're going for the airdrop. Yes, sir. Oh, Bobby Ooh. grabs his custom AK. 
Let's go. The AK-47 sure is going to be so dominant in these games as oh, well. Yeah, hundred percent. One of the best weapons in BR. We got Noah still, still driving to this day. <laughs> 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 we went between the two teams like they were still going around the chopper here here's noah just exploring as well but i, I saw i think bobby had zero but son i know he got a killer two in the opening so he should be yeah all right i think noah is actually waiting on his teammate to get back in from that revive flight he's trying to avoid any conflict right now he should be coming in here in around five seconds yep there it is there's a revive flight coming in over top of radar bs and this zone, I actually kind of like this zone. I like the read RBS zone. It's a cool little area because not many people go over there at all. Not many people land there either. That is true. That is true. Ooh, Tectonic. The NA regional winner in the multiplayer side of the game going for the loadout drop. He blew my mind. Like, I, dude, uh, that first regional event I casted and I didn't know what to expect. My first time casting mobile. And I was like, this guy is disgusting. Oh, but, yeah. Oh, God, yeah. When you're, when you're playing, like, this circle starting to get smaller. Yeah. I know, like, early in games, at least when I play BRs, you know, it's really focus on kills, focus on kills. You don't worry about the circle as much. But, like, is yeah. this kind of the moment now where you really, really have to start to worry about the rotation as it's getting yeah. smaller? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Because right you want to be in that, that good position when the zone starts to get a bit smaller because you don't want to be like a, at a disadvantage you know you got to try to find like that high ground or something like that high well, ground I, middle zone is the move for sure I, I can't even think about the number of games i've lost because of the you know final circle or two like you just it pulls the way you hope it doesn't you, you, you gotta you got lots of, it's part of what makes it great it's part of what makes it frustrating <laughs> hawkson's choice of um character skin is very interesting here i think he's trying to get that camouflage but unfortunately for him, I think he's going to like stick out because it's not the zone as we we saw is not in the green side of the map. He's still going to be able to get the kill though. Let's go. Resume straight down. He's looking good. Didn't AK, I'm going to grab that. Blue quick and then airborne. Okay. I'm just going to pop it right here. Smart play. That's a weird zone though. It is. But that zone's kind of... Yeah. See, I just... I just kind of got bored of using it because it's been up there for so long. It was like when the AK-117 was the most dominant for months and months. It just kind of gets repetitive using it. I'd much rather use that HS nowadays. That's true. HS is fun. Not fun to be on the other side of it, but it is fun. Oh, no chance. <laughs> I'm curious, Kyle, what's like your, what's your like go-to loadout right now? Like your preferred guns that you're running? AK-47 and HS or the AK-47 and the RUS. Okay. What about you, Ferg? AK-47 HS or AK-47 FHJ? Just so I can shit down helicopters and solo squads. I heard one thing in all four. Uh, AK-47. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> you do. You do. If you're really try hard, you should just put it on, honestly. Just hits hard? It does. It hits super hard. And like I said, high grind in the zone. It looks like Little B and Path are chilling right here. But they are using snipers. They did. I'm not really a fan of snipers, Maven. We've talked about this before outside of the casting, but snipers in this game are really hard yeah. to use just because they take so many bullets to kill. It's it's weird. They could they could be punishing in any BR if like if you don't get headshots, right? Yeah. Uh, but but in this, you know, I think when you were talking to me, you said sometimes they could take three or four shots. It seems like hundred percent. It's probably a, yeah a little wiser to go with like a long range AR. Yeah. But if you're I mean, nasty with it and you're popping heads, all right, get rolling. Dude, even if you hit heads, sometimes it's still two shots. Like, if you hit somebody in the head with level three armor adrenaline, it can still be a two shot kill. They are hard to use. Yeah, I don't really sure. use them a lot, but I want to get my practice on them, honestly, because it's so it's so great just using a sniper. It's so satisfying. <laughs> What's been interesting, though, for me, and like, you know, some sometimes in the other Call of Duty BRs, is when it's a custom game, you see a lot more sniping because there's less players, a lot more long range, but. Look at look at how hard this fight looks for Noah and Citrus like having the low ground here <laughs> with somebody like Tectonic on the high ground. They've been there a while. Yeah. We gotta look out for Kublai too. Ooh. Kublai is like is like very OP. He is. That is really actually a good duo. Super, super good duo from BR and multiplayer. Noah spotted one though. Shots dying. I believe he got off maybe like a third of his health right there just from those shots alone. Okay. If I have a teammate Let's support. Let's see if he's going to get the knock right now. Hopefully. I'd love to see Noah put in some work. You do realize Noah dropped that shotgun for the Man OR. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that either, dude. Man OR is not on VR. It is. 
Shotty's coming out. Ooh, Citrus has died. That looks like Noah's dead as well. Whip, Ripperino to Noah and Citrus. Yes, it was. Tectonic and Kublai able to slay them out. It's still early in the game as well. I want to be Tectonic to be my best friend. Kublai with that bot skin. I don't know who he's trying yeah, to fool in these tournaments. <laughs> yeah, he, 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 yeah. Look at he was like jumping and spinning like when he went, he went up. Yeah, dude. He looks like an all star right here, but he's using the bot skin. Okay, buddy. That's some psychological like that yard, plays. Though. No, no. You see, you see a bot skin. You know you're either about to destroy a level two, or it's someone messing with you and you're gonna get yep. world starred. Like there's no in between. <laughs> yep. It's just one there's of the There's never two. an in between. Never. True. True. Bobby and Sun need to get into the zone, dude. They're still chilling at radar. Bobby was still with that goose egg kills. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sniping from Path. They just love the snipers, huh? Path and Little B, that's just all they want to do. It's just snipe and he snipe, 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 snipe. Not really my move. Is that they're trying to avoid that close combat confrontation? Yeah. They're probably just playing for placement. If anything, I mean... Even if you don't get a kill, I guess it's good for, I don't know, getting vision, line of sight, maybe slowing down a rotation for another team. Like, I, I know it's just annoying when you're getting sniped at and you're trying to rotate an open field. Even if, even if you live, it's annoying. We can challenge those guys on the, on the... Yeah, challenge the house. Uh, challenge the house. Challenge the house. I believe there's a team in this house as well. Right, this is team? awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Will there be a team here? There should be. There is. There's footsteps. There's footsteps on the grind. Oh, I somebody dropped small here. bummer. Oh, it's not looking good. Oh, God, he got hit to like a third of his health. Okay, we have, we have, we have. What's this, Hawk's Nest? Hawk's Nest. Yes, Hawk's sir. Nest. Hawk's Nest backed up in that corner in his green oh, ghillie suit oh, no, no, no. <laughs> in the brown area. Let's see what's going to happen. Hey, hey, hey. Jump, jump, jump. Yeah, he's half HP, half HP. Let's listen to the comms. Hit him, hit him as, as he was mudding. Going left. Oh, yeah, yeah. Left side, left side. Pinch him, pinch him, pinch him. Yep. Nice. nice. Slayed out. Path and little be gone. Goodbye. They just didn't have the equipment for it. They had a sniper and an AR. What are you going to do in that situation close range? You want a shoddy. You want some dexterity and versatility. They pushed the wrong team there. <laughs> they did. Completely they wrong got, team. They got real aggro and it did not uh, did not go well. Did not work out for them. Is Tectonic out? I, I only see Kublai. I did not see it, but it looks like my guy, my hog's coming in with a shotgun again. First one, knock, looking for the second. Boom! Gets them both. Fantastic. My hog able to take out Tarzan and Gemini in one file swip of the ninja. Oh, I got it confused. I thought it was. I thought Tarzan did that. Let's go. Tarzan, unfortunately, got destroyed. RIP. Sun looks like he's trying to go for a 1v2. What was that? He chose the airborne, went right into them, and then just dipped on the snowboard. Okay. He he was cruising. I was like, he is flying. Yeah. Across that hillside, but yeah, we're getting down. What? Ten Another people fight? left in the game. Getting into the mix. Going in. Mod six time now. Oh, and that's that's my guy. That's my you guy. <laughs> that's your bald headed brother, yes, Maven. Listen, uh, we stick together. It's like you know the cheap thing. Like it's a bite it the bald thing. Like we we unite. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> Looks like my hawk is just bailing now. He does not want any more action. Kublai, is he trying to challenge? Was that a snowboard action again? I believe so. Ooh, we have Sun here looking for some kills. He's hungry for the kills. They do have good high grind as well. It's so funny the difference between seeing like a phone player and a tablet player. He looks like he's like relaxing, kind of sitting back, you know. Bobby was like oh hovering over. Oh. Here they go. Lots, shot. oh. Lots of missed shots. Lots of missed shots with the shoddy. This is where the shoddy's bad. Oh no. Oh, there we go, son. Finally. That was just awkward to watch and probably to play. Oh, I, I felt bad for both players. No one yes, won sir. that. Oh, Hawks in a. Hox is in a dodgy situation with three HP. Can he clutch? Clutch your kick. No! Oh no. Three times. Oh, he's raging. He's mad. He hit him three times with the KRM and did not get the kill. Three players left. Three yes, players sir. left. It all comes down Some to with this. The high ground. You can kind of see they're in like a old Western standoff here. You've got one 100%. on each side of a triangle, just trying to get position. Kublai does have zone though, so it's looking like it's more in his favor. Chilling in the zone. He's going to want to jump off sometime soon. Maybe go to a house. This is one of those moments where it's frustrating. Like you get the high ground, you feel you're in a great position, then circle pulls away from you, and suddenly it's like mm -hmm. I have to jump down a mountain. <laughs> and he's away. Jumping down. 
and he's chilling. He actually gets to an incredible position now. He does. He's got some time to work with as his own pulls in. He's got the adrenaline as well. Get 150 HP. Oh, I think he has to move again. He definitely has to move again. Yep. Is it going to be the end for Sun? Oh, it's still sunny on Sunside. Oh Let's go. Oh, my God. We've got a oh! wall, a rock, and a box. And a Ludo. <laughs> he got Ludo jump. I'm lucky. That's so lucky that the Ludo drop just manages to land right in the last zone. Ludo drop in that airborne. Is he going to get to use it? He got, he got to get to that airborne right now. Sun Question. slithering up like a snake, though. Like, do you do you take the fight or do you wait for the other? Two third to party, fight? the third okay, party's right down, here, one dude. Kublai, on surely, surely Kublai's gonna clutch it up. Come on! Oh, he sees him. He sees him. He's got the wall hack smoke bomber going on. He gets it. Let's go, go buddy, dude. Let's go, buddy. Easy win. <laughs> yes, sir. Bobby with nice the zero kill done, saying son. the easy win. Let's go. <laughs> The Gusai card to the end. That's ah, what you like to see. Hey, 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 hey. We've all been there. <laughs> we all have. You, do, you, you thank your teammate. You, you do. move on. There's, there's nothing else you can do in that situation, but let's take a look at the overall game one results. Wow. Uh, you can see the total kill. So, yeah, I was talking about if you can get to double digits, the closest it looks like is going to be eight. They were able to put up, but um, what with the placement points, Bobby and Son looking good and kyle it was you that kind of talked about sun early in this one he gets the last laugh in game one yeah he definitely got it getting up a nice 32 points for his team that's awesome that's fantastic but the leader i think was my hawks team with all of those frags those shotgun kills even though they came third they definitely had the more they had the most kills in this game yeah. i mean the most 100%. points <laughs> Yeah, no, and that's why the kills, I mean, it's going to be so important. Like, yeah, you want to focus on placements, a BR, it's important. But right there is a prime example of how important the kills and frags are going to be as you're trying to to fly around the map. And Ferg, I just want to ask you, did you have, a, I don't know, maybe like a favorite moment from that first game? 100%, the Myhawk double kill when he used the ninja to get up to the yeah. rock. Boom, bang, slid around the back of the rock, got his teammate. It was <laughs> over. Well, that, that was that, that was my favorite as well, honestly. Yeah. It was awesome. It's always fun to watch those plays. But as we get ready uh, to get started for our map two, first, let's take a look at some of the highlights from that riveting game one. You got it! You got it! Oh, you got it! On me, on me. Nice. Huge. Another one with the uh, for the first blood. Let's go. Nice. Let's go. Half health, got him, knocked. First kill. Nice, nice. Let's go, let me finish that. First kill, here we go, boys. Oh, he did hurt me. Good shot. I'm down here, though. He's coming to your right, to your right. They're right there in front of you. Get back. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, one down, one down. One down. Nice, 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 nice. Got him? Nice, nice, nice. Let's go. He's low, he's low, he's low. Oh, yeah, yeah. Left side, left side. Pinch him, pinch him, pinch him. Yep. Hit him? Nice. Nice, nice, nice. nice, nice. nice. Oh, I'm going to beat you, sir. Okay. Hey, Lars. I heard ninja. Oh my god. Oh, he third party killed me right there. Nice. Let's go! Let's go, Bobby! Let's go, Bobby! Before we review the standings, we asked our participants some juicy questions. Let's see what they had to say. All right, so the question is, if you were stranded on the isolated Call of Duty Mobile BR map, you can only bring one gun, which one would it be and why? For me, probably gonna be the Annihilator, given the fact that it's like a one shot to the head, it's actually two shots to the body, and on top of that, it's like some auto-aiming weapon, bro. Like, you're not running from the Annihilator. It would definitely be the Locust. I just love sniping too much, and even though snipers in BR aren't quite as good as they are in multiplayer, it's just too addicting. The MW11. Which operator do you resemble most and why? Uh, the operator that I do resemble the most is the Golem. The Golem, it's, a, it's a kind of a snowy character. It looks like he has like a fur coat on his head. And the reason why I resemble that the most is because 
um i always wear a blanket when i'm streaming well not really a blanket it's just like a little a little fur fur blanket and i just throw it on my head and just i smell i just want to be cozy when i'm streaming right which operator do i resemble the most i've been told i look like frank woods probably like 1500 times manta ray my favorite moment in COD Mobile Esports history was, without a doubt, Tectonics 1v4 against Xset Gaming. I believe in the championship of COD Mobile Champs, that was just absolutely ridiculous. My favorite moment so far is when Xset was playing against Tribe Gaming on Search and Destroy Standoff, and Mar Maralto was hitting them locust wall banks through a whole building. Like, that was the most craziest thing I've ever seen. I've never seen something like that in my life so that really just got me hype and everyone was just hype overall in the chat and it was just crazy every moment what type of music do i listen to when i'm fragging out in call of duty mobile so i actually have spotify open right here and some of the top artists that i listen to nowadays and i think today is a perfect example because i was warming up for about 30 minutes before i played i like to listen to post malone a lot j cole drake of course bryce fine one of my favorite as well nf Lil Dicky, like a lot of different artists. I would say the majority of like the, the type of music I listen to is probably just like hip hop or just something like upbeat that makes me feel happy, makes me like kind of hyper and ready to play. Pretty much anything by Chance the Rapper. Ludwig van Beethoven. It says we have 10 seconds. Name as many Call of Duty mobile guns off the top of your head, all right? Timer starts now, I guess. So we got the BK-57, we got the ASM-10, we got the HVK, we got the M21, we got the Locust, we got the Pharaoh, we got the Chickum. We got the uh, AS Val. We got the new PP Bison. We got the uh... AK-117, AK-47, by 15 KRM, HSO-405, HS-2126, Locust, DL Cube, M21, XBR. Okay, um, we'll go through a ARs first. Type 25, uh, M4, SKS, that's not an AR, ASVAL, Chickum, um, PP-19 Bison, is that 10 seconds now? I don't know. Well, I totally botched that question, but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this little interview here with me. Thank you guys so much for watching this event. Let's get back to it. All right, that was an awesome highlights package from the game one, but now let's take a look at the standings. I know it, well, it's not gonna change much from what we saw after the game one, since we only have one game to go off of, but we'll have an order for you now, so you can kind of look through where your favorite players are placed. Um, and yeah, we'll continue on. We got four more games to see how it is going to go. Uh, did you guys see, I'm curious for Kyle and Ferg. Uh, Kyle, we'll start with you. Is there like anyone maybe, I don't know, you think really needs to step it up that you expected more from in that first game? Yeah, definitely. Nevado and Bougie. And we also have, um, yeah, team number six as well. I want to see these guys step it up. They can do it. And I'm looking forward to see that in the rest of the games here. What about you, Ferg? For people I want to see step it up, honestly... I feel like the standings are pretty much how I expected to be for the entire seat, like the entire series of this tournament. The only Seriously? thing I would really? say, yeah, a hundred percent, a hundred percent. Oh, wow. The yeah. only thing I would say is Noah and his teammate Citrus need to be getting placement points if they want to get higher on this leaderboard. They got three kills, they got nine points, but they got zero placement points. And then mm. my hook and Jibito got eight kills. They got a quarter of the entire map wiped off for themselves. That is an insane amount of kills impressive. coming out of the first game. 100%. And then obviously, Maven's bald-headed brother here, Mod6. Yep. Fifth place spot <laughs> with his bro, King Gamer. Looking feisty. Heading uh, into he's... game number two. Uh, he's winning the whole thing. He's winning the whole thing. I, he I, is, I, I guarantee he? it. Uh, no, I have no idea. Uh, you guys are far more experienced <laughs> than I am on this. But all right, that's a look at the standings. Now we're getting ready to go. Continue on with a duo drop-in presented by Call of Duty Mobile. Let's get going. Into the map two. Okay, now we're getting ready to drop in the second time. Uh, Kyle, I guess I'm curious. You had thoughts on how people might drop for the game one. Do you think based on how the first one went, are there any big changes maybe in the drop? Um, I'm not sure, but I do def definitely see the platform here, and I do feel like oh, one yeah. team is gonna 100%. take the chance. I hope one they team takes to. a chance here, and oh, yeah, I'm looking forward what? to that. Citrus already got a kill. What? Extreme was the first to get a kill last game, and now he's first oh. to die. Oh this no! This is just not looking good for him, dude. I they think... of course landed on the platform. Yeah, oh, they got no placement points either. No, right? no one is under no, the platform. Zero placement points, and they're out. I believe oh. they're out. Oh. The TO and Extreme just got eliminated via platform strike. That risk is not looking good for, for that guy right there. What is he? It, it, did, it did not. It just did not pay off for them at all. That's them nine points after two games. Looking kind of bad in terms of 
The money? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Mod 6 landed in my favorite area other than platform, farmland. I love this place. So many different buildings, so many different engagements you can have over here. And it looks like they're about to get into an engagement with a couple of wicked players. Yeah, let's see what's going to happen here. Farm yeah. is definitely one of the nicest places to just hike, have a fight. A lot of cover. Oh, oh, Jokes to go Mod 6. Get him back up in the mix. Oh, he's oh. Got me. Absolutely. He beat. did. He did. If I was King Gamer, I would probably dip. Not going to lie. Oh, get no. a different position. Maybe try and get some high grinds. Settle on a shed. Something like that. To get well, out of that can, situation. Can you guys break down, maybe for new viewers, uh, you know, there's a lot of different BRs out there. There's different ways to get your teammates back into the action. Uh, just for the new person. How does that work, Ferg? So basically what happens is if your teammate dies, you can go over their dead body, collect their tag, and then you can revive flight them by clicking revive on their tag once you pick it up. And as you can see, Japito, he's going to need to get his tag collected from whoever has his teammate right, oh. right now. I believe it's my hog. But once you get the uh, the revive flight back and you've collected their tag, revived them, it takes around 60 seconds for the revive flight to come in. And you need to stay alive those whole 60 seconds. Once they come back into the revive flight, they can go anywhere in the map. It's just like getting a respawn and restarting okay. your entire game again. Uh, Kyle, can I ask you a very serious question? Shoot. Is, is there a chance that Sun and Bobby's team wins this entire event with Bobby getting zero kills? <laughs> it, it, the chances are high for that. The chances are high for that. <laughs> but, but hopefully God, Bobby's man, able to get bro. some kills here. We want to see Bobby get some kills. Let's go. Facts, I want to see Bobby fragging out. Bobby actually started off the entire COD Mobile cycle being pretty bad, but he's improved a lot over the past year and a half. And I think a lot of the community would agree with me in saying that he's actually a really good player now. That's the funniest compliment I've ever heard. Did he? Did, he, started no, off really he'll, bad. he'll take that. He was, he was terrible. No, but he yeah, knows, dude. Good. No, he knows. He knows. Because no, he was I, known as like Bobby Baugh, and now he's not, actually really good at the amazing. game. No, so. he seems uh, he seems like a good dude you could have uh, have a laugh at. So, uh, oh yeah, hundred no, percent. I want to see him. I want to see him pop off too for sure. But what we I view is, Bobby as like Tim the Tapman of mobile, but he's better at the game than how I would see Tim the Taman as oh. at maybe Warzone you know, or some other Call of Duty. Yeah, yeah, that's um, how I consider myself uh, in, you know, in different games too. Yeah, just, uh, I do stupid stuff. I die in stupid ways, but sometimes I'm wildly talented. Yes, sir. And this looks, is this Nevado? Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, it definitely is. And he is getting shot. We see the medic here. The, the medic is a class that our people usually use in these tournaments here. So I think we're going to see a lot of medic action. Does the medic yeah, heal up your teammate as well, Kyle? It does. It does. It does, does it? it? See, does. I would never know because I never play with anyone. Yeah. <laughs> and I never use that class because of that. So oh, no. I would never know. They're in a sticky situation right now, it seems. They are. Kind of scared to push as well. Team. Bolu and Marshy should have some good chemistry, even though they never play BR because they're yeah. actually teammates in the multiplayer side of things. Yeah, you think we'd add something. Like, 100%. Oh, yeah. Jim dead again. That's the Jokesta as well. Jokesta able to pick up two kills at the start of this? Oh. Sheesh, he's oh, looking fired to today. I don't have kills that much. Yeah, I don't, I, he's gonna probably push us. I was trying to listen for a yeah, second as they talk about it. Like, they think the push yeah, is coming. They're ammo. trying to hold. I, you yeah, know, yeah. It's tough to fight the roof, but sometimes it's weird in these games. Like. Yeah, it's like you can use that wall as such a nasty yeah, bit of cover yeah. that yep. you almost have an advantage in gunfights. hundred percent. Which yeah. third person peeking seems, advantage. Yeah, it seems backwards, but like, yes, that, exactly that, like peeker advantage. hundred percent. Oh, I don't have any ammo. Uh, oh, Jokes doesn't have any bullets though. <laughs> That's not looking good, dude. At least he got two kills. Oh. And just a reminder for you guys, when we're checking, you know, the, uh, the scoreboard, just keep a keep an idea of the number of your favorite team, because that, that's how it's going to be listing it. So if you got somebody you're rooting for, just remember that number for them. So when we're looking at the map, various spots, you can you keep an eye on the, the team you're rooting for. And it will stay the same throughout the entire tournament, I believe. Right, Maven? Uh, I'm actually not 100% sure on that, but I would I would assume so. Yes. But if it changes game to game, you'll you'll see it. You'll see it there on the scoreboard. But no, I think I think it does. Oh, little V and Path with the Bertha. <laughs> They're never dying in that thing. It, it's a tank. It, it, it is. It's an it absolute is tank. tank. Look at it. Look, look at it going. It's cruising, too. <laughs> it is. 7,000 horsepowers. <laughs> 7,000. <laughs> I don't know anything about cars at all. I, I don't even know what a normal horsepower is, to be entirely honest with you. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, drove a, I drove a 98 Camry for about a decade. So. Oh, Sheesh. Huh. Yeah. I do it to intimidate. It looks like we're going in for a creator listening right here. 
with jokester they're gonna be trying they're gonna they're that heli is gonna try to go for the drop yeah, yeah. So they're gonna go for the what do you want to do um they're probably waiting they're gonna land on us that's the thing oh someone's flying oh, here yeah it's got a guy airboarding i hit him i hit him hard nice where did he go oh, he's oh, going I, I don't know where that guy went right there but i believe it was maybe over to the other side of the road he was trying to get away because jokes his teammate actually hit him a couple times yeah he, he actually ate some bullets yeah. and well, bobby again outside of the zone Classic Bobby. What? Come on, man. I want to see some action. I want to see some high kill gameplay, Bobby. I think it's a strat. Look how far he is. Where he's the strat for it is the strategy. Okay. They won okay. last game, so let's see if it's going to play out for them the same way. Yeah, yeah. My guy's in Antarctica right now, dude. I'm trying to see some high kill gameplay. Listen, Bobby, you know, he may come off as lovable and goofy, but he's actually a, a strategic strats. mastermind. He is. Yeah. Oh, he yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. Big brain. Plays. I know what strat he's playing. But I just don't like to see it. I know exactly what he's doing. <laughs> We're looking at Moralto and Envoy now, though. IQ. It is. It is. That's actually a pretty good zone. There's a couple of really hilly areas over around launch base where you could get the high ground, especially in the middle. That is Real quick, true. I want to ask you guys earlier with the, with the choppers, like in, you know, different BRs sometimes, like you can rip people out of them pretty easily. What's it like in this? Is it is it really difficult to rip someone out of a chopper? Like, yeah. So much health. It's definitely so much difficult. Health. It's hard to get that well, not hit. Not even destroying it, but like shooting them out of it. Like how how yeah, difficult? That's is what, it? Yeah, I understood. Yeah, that it's hard to get a shot like that. <laughs> almost <laughs> really almost hard. impossible. Unless they're about to take off from the helicopter and you get to like shoot them before they, they take off. At about a minute. Oh yeah, when they're like sitting ducks there. <laughs> yeah. Is Hawksness on top of a friggin' He is! He's on top of a turbine! Well, I that's mean, actually a six spot. Hawk's nest is in How the did Hawksness Hawk's get there? He is. He really is. That could easily be a Hawksness for sure. Unfortunately, he's not in the zone, so he's gonna have to move either way. This is the person that kills me in a BR and I rage for 10 minutes. Yeah, this is the person that makes you rage yeah. quit. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> What's he For doing sure, up there? Dude. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> How'd he get there, dude? That was my question. How did he get there? Speaking of high ground, Aerith has got the exact spot where I would go in the zone currently, and it looks yeah. like Noah and his teammate Citrus wants to take it off them. We have Tarzan and Gemini pushing in as well. Are they? Did they stop? Ooh. I think they stopped. Noah's I think there's a fight going on up there. Oh, no! Oh, no! It just got pro blocked. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, oh no! He's getting shot. There's three getting shot. different teams. What is this? No, it's oh, missing dear. shots. Oh no! Is no gonna go down here? Oh he's no, gone. goes down. He's, he's gone. Gemini and Tarzan cleaning up right there. Cleaning up. Is is Citrus gonna be able to get those tags though? It's 23 seconds until the next revive flight, so let's see what's gonna happen. He should I would get those tags and leave. Yeah, with the snowboard too. He's gone. Yeah, uh, he's away. It is, it's wild how much ground you can cover. Like he yeah. got that and just dipped. Yep. I can't believe that Aerith actually survived that. Do you think he's he dipped? Do you he scanned the tag? Yeah, I think he's got I think it. So I think he got it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did. I'm not 100, percent but I think I think so. Okay. Okay. Nevada wants the high grind, dude. All these people are coming too late to the high grind. You That's need to be an early rotator. You're just not right? gonna get it. Too damn late. And it's in the middle of the zone. Like, these people should have been on this. I know, right? The They're fighting for King maybe, of the Hill right now. Yeah. Maybe it's just because, like, I used to play in these kind of tournaments Ooh. on different games that I'm like, I know the stuff. But I feel like there should be Ooh. so many more people up there. Oh, we got Nevado and um, we got team number three and team number four about to fight each other. These are if my I two was Nevado, teams. I wouldn't even bother. Wow. I wouldn't even go near there. They, yeah, no point now. Yeah, yeah. Earlier, Maybe, I, they should have been there with the helicopter, but nowadays, cool. there's already two so, teams. If you two were teaming, no, it's back. Berg and Kyle duo, yeah. would you win this entire thing? Of, yeah, of course, bro. Easy clap. <laughs> easy, easy, easy Zero clap. deaths, dude. Love Zero it. deaths. <laughs> we're talking 32 tip kill game plays. <laughs> right? Well, every kill in the lobby plus some. <laughs> oh, right? no, he's getting beasted. Oh, he's dead. It's gone. Ooh, Tarzan, Tarzan killing him. They're leaving Citrus the high ground. Him, though. Let's see what's. Oh. What's gonna happen? Oh, Noah goes down again by the the. What is it? What was? What Citrus was clutched. It? Citrus clutched. He got both of them. Gemini and Tarzan are right. That means what, that the is high that? ground is sweet. Oh my god. So that Citrus is, is Noah's he pro got player. His teammates tag. Yeah, he got his teammates tag. He got out of dodge. He gets back in the mix. He kills both players. Like Citrus is popping off. 
Yep, he's absolutely popping off. One thing I might just say, we didn't even discuss it there, but Tectonic just sniped someone easy. off of a snowboard. Easy. Yeah, he literally we got, just we got sniped a... someone off. I think it was Fantas. He sniped Wait, him what? off of the snowboard while the snowboard was going across the map. That was a crazy snipe. So far in this game, that has to be the, the best play. <laughs> yeah, that was the craziest oh. snipe I've probably seen uh, for at least Dude, a couple he's months. Ins he's okay. nuts. He, he, the, guy is, the guy is insane. The first All time right. I watched him, I didn't think he was human. Oh, no. <laughs> Bobby and Son are really they're, they're chilling in the push, zone. Yeah, they're gonna At push somebody in, here. Though. Is this it's path pushing? team? Aerith and Demione, I believe. There's that, Tag. That other teammate from team number 15 is pushing in. Yes, sir. That would be Demione. He just got revived from Aerith. I just want to play this to snowboard, snowboard around the map. Like, I don't even care about anything Snowboards else. are I so wanna... fun. It, it definitely changed yeah. how you move around in Battle Royale. You have to have it a does. snowboard. <laughs> It changed the whole dynamic of how the game was played. Much well, more played, quick now. I mean, this is like, you guys were not even born yet, but it was like, what was it, like SSX Tricky or something back in the day? Like those snowboard games I played as a, a tongue growing up as a kid. They were so fun. This looks like that, but you get to fight too. Oh, oh yeah. My gosh. Oh yeah. Just imagine that with a BR and that's what you've got in this game. Yeah, imagine these awesome. guys, imagine these guys seeing the tank here and can't use it. <laughs> yeah, the tank is on <laughs> they the can't map. go in it. Oh Yikes. no. It was rocking the trickster. That's my favorite one. Oh, he's gone. It's over. Demine's out. Already? He just got revive flighted. Now it's all down to Aerith again. The same team. It looks like Noah and Citrus are actually really far away from the zone, though. Well, in game one, didn't they die? Were they, were they the team that flew on top of the like the shack that Hawksness was at? Is that they drive? They got, they got really aggressive and dropped? I was passing Little B. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they went on top of Hawks and got, mind, yeah, they got killed straight away. I was trying away. to remember how they dropped, because you mentioned they really needed to get uh, placement points. And I, I yeah, they did, they, they, they did. In the first game. Marshy, though. The multiplayer pro. The sub for the NA Regional Championship team. Oh, he's gone. Snowboarded out of there. He knows what's you're, up. You're <laughs> casting him up like he's about to go take his fight. <laughs> nah, he's out, dude. At least he's out. playing for placement, you know? All right. Well, as I am a, a member oh, of the Sun fan club. What? The Yo, he hit him twice. Whoa. Sun's awesome. The shotgun god drops. Oh, Yo. no. No. My hug, no. It was going so well, first game. Second F, game was going F, good too. F, F, let's go. Uh, F's in the chat right now. For my guy, my hog, Sun cleaning out. Is Kuba I see him in the shack? I love how casual Sun looks when we go to his camera, dude. He's just yes, frying. He he's just looks chilling. like he's just he's sitting back. Chilling, bro. He yeah. looks ah, little B in path dead straight away. Tectonic slaying out with his teammate. Ooh. He's up to three now, because when he hit the snipe, he yep. just got those two. Yep, light work for Tectonic. Ha, dude, the tank is right in the middle of the zone. <laughs> well, I think I think Noah and Citrus right now are leading the way with five. So now it's going to get to that point, though, as you were saying. They really got to get placement points. You're getting the kills. Yep. Yep. Get some placement points. If I was them, I would strictly go for placement at this point. Five kills well, is a great yeah, like, mine. Ex exactly. Like, do you do you kind of go out of your way to not take fights? Just focus on being geared up in this final circle. Uh, we'll see Did, what they do. See, to be honest... I think a really good strat would be to camp beside a tank because the people know that tanks aren't allowed to be used, so they won't even look at them. If you camp on the side of a tank and leave yourself not exposed to like a solid angle where a lot of people are, I think that could actually play in your favor, especially considering it's on the edge of zone. Ooh, if you go behind the tank on the edge of zone, you're in a pretty good spot. Like Team 5 could just roll in here, camp behind the tank and set up. Both these teams are going to go together. They're yes, going to come together to see a fight here. I want to see a fight. Haven't seen a Me fight too. in a while. Come on, guys. <laughs> the zone's pretty small. <laughs> yeah, they're probably thinking, you know, what I was talking about. Like, just getting set up, getting these yep. points. But, I want set up. That's what uh, I would be I wanting. Mean, there's, something's going to have to go down here, and it's Sun and Bobby up top. We'll see if Bobby can get his kill or if Sun's going to uh, dominate, uh, but they're just oh, rotating my, behind him on the low uh, ground. Oh, here, switch, switch, switch. My guy Sun has a yeah. Tempest with 430 yeah. shots. That, what that doesn't look good. It doesn't take one shot to um It's ten, think, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think it's ten. Yep. So we've got forty-three he's, he's, he's tempest shots. Lot. Now Maven, if you don't know what the tempest does, it electrifies you and stops you from moving. That's how my guy Son was able to kill my hawk as he was running away, because he shot him once and then he was paused because he was electrocuted and then he was able to get the second shot off. So this could actually be really good. Or my I guy's son. Used it in this title, but back in what, like Black Ops 3 and stuff. Now I yeah. love the Tempest. It's so, oh, yeah. it's so fun. It's really underrated in this game, actually, in my opinion. True. I think lately it's been getting like some recognition. 
lately. A lot of yeah. more people are trying to use it, but it's definitely not an easy weapon to use. And it's no kind of it's kind of it's kind of powerful. So I think that's a good thing. It balances it yeah. all out. Especially because the time it takes the shot to go across the map to hit the person is yeah. really difficult. I think I think we're gonna have a fight now. Hundred percent. All the teams are coming see? in. The zone's closing. It's collapsing in. Team six is going in between team four and team one, and then Marcy's just chilling oh, in a shack. No. It's crazy when you look at the map. Like they all look so clustered up. Yeah, they're just they not engaging yet. But it's got yeah. to be happening here any moment. They're picking their fights. They know Smart Marcy's there, there, dude. Here we got Marcy is in trouble. Oh, they're all oh, snowboarding, dude. No. This is Sheesh. awesome. <laughs> Marcy doesn't want any of that action. Oh no, sun season. I didn't though. know he was a snowboarding Whoa! color. What a shot! Off the oh, snowboard shoot. with the tempest, dude. I... He's nasty. Oh dude, no! I'm picking Marsh. Or I'm picking Sun up again if I ever play him one of these, dude. <laughs> I'm picking him strip by God. Sun is goaded, man. Sun is goaded. He's cracked. He is goaded. Facts. Smoke bombers out though. Resume. I believe he was the one that used it. He's trying to shoot through it. I don't see them yet. Jokes obviously doesn't see it because he doesn't have it on. Once we. We can't see it with this position. Ha I think Hawkins just went out. Yeah, he just got destroyed, unfortunately. Here somewhere. Completely wiped. Bobby just Bobby killed himself. Down. He just Bobby killed himself. What? Oh, oh no. he didn't get it. He's gonna put Sun in another tough spot. Dude, Sun, Sun is outside of his own. I, I think Sun was prepared for this. I think Sun was prepared for this. He was. He's got the meds, and now the Bobby's dead. He can oh. pick up his meds as well. I would just nice. go for placement points. Try and get into the zone as best as possible. I swear, if Sun pulls out this win by himself again. Tectonics out. Bro, I'm going crazy, bro. Eight, eight players left. Kublai in a dodgy position here. He's already been shot. Ooh, Kublai, come on. Let's see what's going to happen. Kublai can Ooh, clutch this. Movement. Kublai is equipped to clutch But there's this. so many teams there. He could just get shot from any side. Yeah, yeah. Like, Jokes just shooting him from the side. What the? Oh, Resume able to pick him up. Nevada's dying. It's over for him. His team is still alive, though. It all comes down to this. Only seven players left. Jokes already has two kills. He could pick up another one. Please, hi. Are you good? Are you good? I haven't seen Sun yeah, die yeah. either. Has he died yet outside of the zone? Boogie's dying as so. well, Nevada, when Boogie, you're right. I don't know. No one has extreme high ground with Citrus. No, Sun's, Sun's still up, alive. Sun's oh, no. He's in the zone too, in the smoke. Yeah, they've all been oh fighting. my god. They, they have. They go at it. Hold on, if they go at it, he might be able to pick them off. Citrus is going for him though. I think he knows. Oh. Citrus knows all about the strats. Oh, Citrus gone. kills yeah, him straight away. Gone. Great placement points though there by Sun. Great stuff. Resume's going down to Noah. Kublai just killed Jokester. Oh. That's their whole team out. It's now all down to Citrus, Noah, and the last player alive who Wait, I don't know. They they have the most kills too. Right? This could be a monster, oh, yeah. monster oh, game yeah, for them here. Absolutely. Absolutely. I think they've got this in the bag. A 1v2 doesn't seem very likely against a player like Noah and a teammate like Citrus. It's Honestly, Kublai it's as well, though. He's, he's a good player. He's got really good position here behind a metal wall. I think Kublai is going to clutch it. I'm just going to go for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. No it way. No I shot. I There's think no Kuba is going to clutch it up. Let's see. I, I, I love the clutches. I love the clutches. I, okay. I don't think it's going to happen, but if I mean, it does, that would be insane. It should that would oh, be they give him, it, it, Thus, they give him two one-on-ones. They just oh. can't give him two one-on-ones. No, yeah, that's, that's exactly guys, it. That's, They're spread they pretty nicely is? right here. Oh, he's one push. Citrus they is do. Push, yep, yep, I think they do. I think oh, by now, oh. he's, yeah, he's, he's gone. Or there's no oh. way. He dropped yeah, the airborne. Yeah. Can he use the shotgun it? Shotgun shots come in. No. Kublai gets citrus though. Kublai oh. gets citrus. No, it's not in his shots. Oh, he got him. He got oh, no. him. Well no, played, no. I thought he nearly clutched Bro, that. Bro, I dude. told you. I told you. And that, that's what I'm saying. Like, oh, they had no. to make it a two on one. You had to yeah. get the trade. Yeah, yeah. They, they don't. 100%. The only way they lose that is if they don't have the insta trade like that. So thankfully, yeah, Noah that doesn't crumble under Noah pressure. He hits oh, the shot. I thought it was going to happen there. I yeah, really thought too. it was about to happen. I literally thought it happened. Points. Dude, they, yeah, the win what? plus nine kills. What? That's nearly double the points of the Damn. highest score last game. That's 20 that's more points. That's a lot of kills. That's a lot of, that's a lot highest, of points. That is, that, that's going to shoot them straight up the standing. Nine points and a first place finish. That's over a quarter of the that's kills. That's insane. That's insane, honestly. We got Tectonic, Tectonic still finishing really good. And Myhawk still third place. They were first last game. So they're looking really nice as well. Coming in with a total of 60, I believe, right now. Well, we had, I mean, a ton of wild moments. Uh, what, uh, Tectonic sniping somebody off a snowboard, uh, Sun and the Tempest play, Citrus with the revive clutch in the 1v2. Like, he, I, I guess I want to know, Kyle, like, what, what, what stood out for you there? What was your favorite moment? My favorite moment was that moment that Ferg called out 
when um I don't remember who it was that shot that guy off the snowboard with a sniper. That was Tectonic, actually insane. Right? Yeah, 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 sir. That was insane. Got to give the credit. <laughs> Hitting shots, Ferg. What about you? Honestly, my favorite moment was probably when Kublai was about to clutch it because it just got me, got my adrenaline running. I thought he was actually going to do it because no one missed the so shot. Too. You know what I mean? I was like, there's no way because Kublai's got a one shot shotgun in his inventory. If he had hit Noah right there, it could have been all over and he could have clutched it for his team. So I was kind of hoping for that, but it just didn't go in his favor. There are a few things better than the final moments of a battle royale game. It, uh, it gets very, very intense, but you know, we're talking through some of the best moments throughout that. How about we take a look at them? Let's check out the highlights package from game two. I'm gonna be a little bit further out because I may are. They're jumping out. They're landing. They're on the squad. Hey, yeah. Got him. Nice, nice. I got one, I got both. Nice. He's got me, nice shot. I hit my map, bro. Before we review the standings, Hawksnest, who's participating in this tournament, showed us his favorite loadout. What's going on, COD Mobile fans? My name is Hawksist, and today we're going to be taking a look at the BR meta inside of COD Mobile. Now, when it comes to BR, you're going to be getting in engagements of all different ranges, so it's really important to have two types of weapon. One, a weapon that is overall versatile, but is really dominant at anywhere from mid to longer ranges. Now, there are a couple different approaches you can take for weapon builds inside of the custom BR, and I'm not here to tell you guys exactly what you have to do, but I am going to talk about what you're going to see a lot of the pros doing. So, the most common weapon you're going to see in BR used by pro players is going to be the AK-47, and it's essentially going to be built in two different ways either one a extremely versatile ak-47 that can do basically all ranges or one that's built for a little bit more mid to longer ranges and then they pair that with a shotgun typically the hso 405 or the krm is also a good ground loot alternative using a good shotgun paired with the ak-47 will allow you to be versatile enough to play basically all ranges and have very good time to kills except for extremely long ranges if you're a player that likes to play at extremely long ranges what's recommended is using a arctic 50 paired with with an AK-47 that's built a little bit more for close range so that you can use the AK-47 for close to mid range and then you can use the Arctic 50 for those longer distance engagements. So those are two of the most popular approaches and then every player will have a different build but you really want to build the weapon to fit the type of play style that you are going for. So once again with your AK-47 you have to determine whether or not you want to use it as more of a close to mid range uh, AR or you want to use it more of a mid to long range AR. Personally I like to build the AK-47 like this where I use it for long to mid range and then I'll use a shotgun for my closer range engagements but once again you could build this gun however you want it just depends on your secondary to kind of fill in uh, whatever your ak-47 isn't good at but once again 99 percent of the community or the pro community is going to be using the ak-47 as their primary weapon because of the versatility and how accurate this weapon can be and how the time to kill is pretty much good at every single range inside of br so thank you guys for watching and that's going to be it for me some incredible moments from that game too, but now I do want to check out the overall standings that we've tallied these together and it's getting a bit crazy. Tied with 65 points in first place. We've got Noah and Citrus and Tectonic and Klubai right behind them, Bobby and Sun, uh, because they got that game one victory, they have 51 points. But Kyle, I'll tell you what, man, that monster game from Noah and Citrus it's huge. Puts them right at the top of the leaderboard. Yeah, de definitely. They've been playing a good game so far in this tournament. So it, they definitely deserve that first place for right now. And for, I guess I'm curious, like, I know, I know we have three more games and you just saw one where you can get a ton of points and make a swing early, but is it sort of do or die time now in this game three for some of the people at the bottom leaderboard? I would say at the bottom of the leaderboard, this game is it. If they cannot do something in this game, it's not going to be looking good. They will not finish in the top three podium position. And then as well, for the people who are like eighth to fifth, they could easily have a swing game and go straight to the top of the leaderboard. But it really kind of depends on whether or not Tectonic and Noah's team have a standout game again. Because if Noah and Citrus have one more standout game or Tectonic has one more standout game, they're going to win, in my opinion. I yeah, think they would be wrapped. <laughs> Yeah, 100%. Like, 
a lot of times this type of format, like, you know, having one great pop-off game is, is awesome and all, but usually the team yeah. that wins at the end of it is the one that's consistent. So can, can they yeah. continue to consistently go off? But games one and two are in the rear view mirror. Time to continue on. Let's start off with our game three. Uh, we'll see how mixy it gets. We've had a lot of fights early in the game, and sometimes that's kind of set the tempo for how the teams have done throughout the course of it. You know, you win an early fight, you get looted up, you're able to fly and fry across the map. But I'm just wondering if anything's going to be a little bit different here with regards to the drop or if anything's going to get going. I want to see another platform drop, to be honest. Same, same, same. All right, boys, the plane is in. Here we go. The doors Let's see are where these guys in. are going to get going. <laughs> yeah, but uh, we're focused on Noah and Citrus's plane to start. Just had a fantastic game. Let's see. Oh, platform is here again. I think people are going to land. Yo, this, there's a lot of good drops here. Radar base, black market, platform. Dying Tyne, yeah. Planetarium. I want to see platform, a, though. Please. Yeah, platform. Let's Again. see who's going to jump platform. Who's going to take that risk? Off. I'm hoping Noah and Citrus back there again. That would be a sight to behold. One yeah. thing I didn't say at the, at the end Ooh. of the last game is that Bobby oh. and Hawkstaff are both really close to the leaderboards as well. And that's three of the yeah. biggest content creators in Call of Duty Mobile all lined up right behind each other. There is three, oh. four teams on this platform. Yo, these guys are not missing around. Oh, no. Oh, one out. One out. Oh, no. Citrus. It's no Citrus. My God, at first frag to them, that's an extra nine points. They got the first two kills. That's good for them right now. That's fantastic. That's That puts them in a really good spot at the start of this game as well. Already on the bus. Now, right, we'll focus over to farmland, but that citrus has just been dominating in those first gunfight situations. But well, you're gonna be wide oh, in the open, just gotta hit your point. shots. There it is. And my, my, okay, mod six, you're letting me down. You're letting me down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he spotted him. Oh, in, though. oh my god, that it's guy looks so, bad. so bad. Now. That's right. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Let's see if he can get away. Oh, he he's him. unable he to get him. away. That was very well done from Jim right there. Why were we going to go to next, up? though? <laughs> That's I have no idea. It almost looked like he just kind of hit a bump. And now we're going to be going in, I believe, to a career Ooh, listening with my Oh, my God. Whoa, that was too close. That was way yeah, too it close. Looks, that looks so crazy. The, like, the grenade notifications, like just five popped up on his screen. Yeah. My heart doesn't even have any meds. Oh, yeah. Who has that? Did somebody just use medic? They did. What about? I don't speak this language or understand oh, yeah. what they're saying, oh, but they're okay. chilling. They're chilling. They're chilling. He just got some meds. Plus, the yeah. medic is dropped in. They're yes, looking sir. good. Godsley and Valor outside of the zone, along with Hawks and Rosie. Team 13 and Team 14 could have a fight here on farm, though. Choo -choo. They're looking really close together. That's me. Oh, we got Godsley. I don't even we haven't know. seen too much of Godsley this entire tournament. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll see something this game. I think this is the first okay. time we're seeing him. Oh, level three, let's go. Nice. You sure? Yeah. All right, I got my new sense, so or like my actual sense, so we're good. He's in a good spot. His teammate, I think, just celebrated yeah. finding a level three. I think I think is what he said. Yeah. See what's going on level over there? Always great. Town. A lot of people making their way over to like that side of the game right now. Oh, of course, Bobby. <laughs> Bobby, ah, on the zero Bobby. kills. All right, I'm not going to call out Bobby anymore. I'm not bullying Bobby anymore. Let's go. I will, I'll, 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 I'll continue to do it if you guys stop. Don't worry. I'll, I'll, I'll carry, I'll, I'll oh, carry no. that burden. Dude, Bobby's my guy, dude. Yeah. I just want to see him pop right. off. Yeah. yeah, they're what are they in third? They're, they're all right. Yeah. They're 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 in are. Third, yep. They are. They're in some good money. Some good money. I just don't like seeing so far away from the zone in terms of. We're going to have a fight over here in nuclear plant. Yes, sir. This looks, this looks, this looks crazy. Extreme to Tio. The first team to get the first frag in the entire tournament. Yep. Looking for another one. It's Citrus Whoa. and Noah. This is not a oh. fight you want to take, guys. That is true. You just want to back off. Get away. That, that's the only kill they've gotten, though, right? Because they, they yeah. dropped is, at the beginning that, of the yep. second game. They had knocked out right away. Is that Tectonic exactly. up top? It, it, I believe it's to Tio up top. Extreme teammate. Noah's actually kind of in a dodgy position here because yeah. he's got a really low ground on Tio, but That's he sees right. him. Oh no! Instantly. We got that knock. Insta kill. Yes, sir. 
This guy up top needs to push right now. He should have pushed a long time ago. Let's see what's going to happen. I don't think he has enough health. I think he's less than half HP. If Probably. he doesn't have any meds, he's in a dodgy yeah, position. He should just stay, honestly. He should just stay and wait to know and that guy yeah. leaves so we could um see like him get those tags. 100%. First two airdrops down as well. Team 15 looking for one. No way and Citrus are probably looking for the other. Back right. on board with Godly. They're still chilling yeah. here. They're still chilling. And as much loot as possible. They did get the secret room in Sanitarium, yep. which gives them some nice level 3 armor. Yep, yep. You like they, to see it? They won't be chilling for too long because they have a team there with them too. And then team 1, 14, and 13 farm? are all beside each other. Bro, farm is about to get lit. We're going to see a yeah. lot of action in this farm. I believe Team Yeats now coming in as well. There's one. Oh, it's Hoxie. Hoxie Pay! <laughs> They're coming for you! He's going up on the high ground, though. I like this play. The teams are already Ooh, here. He just got stuck! Oh, Hoxness, come on, dude! You gotta hit them shots, brother. Hoxness is he shot dipping. the grass a lot. Did they get a knock? Yeah, I think they got. Oh. Yes, they did. They got the full kill on Jokesta. Who smoke is this? I'm looking for the final guy. I believe it's the other person in the team. They gotta be careful. Yeah, they do. Resume, I think he just dipped, honestly. He got the tag and he was out. Oh, we got some airborne action going on here. Oh, Jim. Ah, he doesn't even want the fight. He wants to leave. How, how is my boy up here? What is, what oh, is this? I just kill, yo, I just killed Hogs. <laughs> he joined him. Oh, no. Oh, he killed him. I'd be so mad. That's a rage oh, quit no. moment right there, Maven, if I've ever seen one. Yeah, no, this... A, a, a cheeky spot. Very, very cheeky. No, that uh, that would be a frustrating death for sure. But circle it and smaller. What the four teams, uh, everybody in except for kind of the farmland squads that are still battling it out and have to get in. Now the question is, once they get in, though, what are they going to have to go through? But over to Novato, he's got a chopper to work with. Also looking for the high ground, just trying. He spotted him. He spotted Citrus and Noah. The Tio is still alive. He did not die to Citrus and Noah. He got out of there. But now Novato and Bougie are on top of them. This is just looking like a standoff here, to be honest. Yeah. Those were like bait shots. <laughs> well, we took the bait. Team six and eight. Oh, it's Sun and Bobby. Center zone oh, with the Annihilator. Yeah, on the and the FHJ. Oh, no, what, a what a loadout. He hit them once. What a oh, loadout. They're not even getting out. Oh, that's oh, the GG's. Little B and Path not having the knowledge to do it and jump out of that because they play too multiplayer. Much faith in that, that ATV. Yeah. Yeah, yeah too much he, faith in that they ATV. Don't, they, don't they don't have the knowledge. They yeah, don't yeah. play BR as much as the next guys. Oh, no. And that just, it was detrimental to their lives right there. Back on board with Bougie, though. Yeah, we still have a team right stand up here. Uh, Nobody yes, switched. And then Godsley and Valor are over across the way looking for the third party as well. <sighs> It'd be interesting. Let's see what's going to go down here. I want to see that this push right now. This is the push everyone's been waiting. Oh, here it is. He here it is. Nevada's jumped. Here it is. Dude. Nevada said no more playing oh, around. Let's see what's going to happen in the here. Side. Shots right. are dying. Oh, Nevada threw that smoke bomber. Oh, oh, oh. He got him. He got him. No, he's dead. He's getting no down. It's a 1v2 situation now, though. It's not looking good okay, for Citrus. Citrus. It's not looking good whatsoever. They haven't even taken an, an inch of damage. Right. I hear, I, I hear, hear somebody, somebody else jump Yeah, off. yeah. Yep, yep. Full kill's coming in. Looking fantastic. Ooh. Let's do a listen in. Right now. Oh, is Ghazi pushing in? Ghazi pushing in. Oh, no, Ghazi got bougie. Ghazi got bougie. Oh, what is it? Oh, my God. What a shot. What a shot. Let's go. That was insane. Ah, uh, he's getting hyped now. You got to love that. Godsley. We we're finally uh, starting to see some action from his POV. Fantastic play, but Citrus is still here and lurking. Being a sneaky little snag. Oh my god. 100%. He's going to want to get Noah's tags as well. See, Citrus is a very advanced player. He knows what's up. The question is, will he be able to get the tag before Noah dies permanently? I mean, Godsley and Valor are both outside of this silo now. So he could sneak in if he's confident in taking them on in both 1v1 fights. Do they? Oh, I was just going to ask if he knows that someone is there. Oh. oh! 
Who's that? No way, he's gonna kill him. Oh, Citrus, Citrus is, is out. No way, Citrus are gone. Citrus is well, out. Already? Zero placement points for Noah and Citrus right there, no, but they no. did that... get the first frag and a double kill, so they still have 10. I'm not sure how many kills they got total, but at least 10 points for them. Definitely. That's board. huge for the rest of the pack because, like, they were yep. they were leading the way. They're in first place. They, they, they had that pop up. off game the second time, and I think you guys kind of nailed. Like, if they have a huge game here, they might just really take a take away with it. At least with regards to the lead, that death though, kind of an opening now for everybody else. Hundred percent. That's going to be massive for Tech Tonic and Kublai. They're still alive. However, they do have zero kills, so they're going to need to pick up the pace if they want to take over Noah and Citrus. Are they really going up the ladder? I know. That's so dangerous. It's a long ladder. Yeah, that's a very yeah. long ladder. He's not in the zone either. I don't know if that's oh, wow. the way. You feel like a free kill. Like I feel like every yeah. time you, you climb a ladder in any BR, it's terrifying. Oh, we got Bobby. Yeah. My Sun. favorite player in the entire world. I think Sun has the Annihilator again. Oh, it's Bobby with the Annihilator this time. I mean, the Tempest, sorry. Yes, sir. Hit it, Bobby! Just do it from the chopper! Come on, Bobby, we believe. We, we believe, Bobby, we believe. Hit it, Bobby! Oh, he can't shoot it, he can't shoot it! Come on, Come on. Bobby! No! My God! He's just taking his the, time, guys. He's just taking his time, lining up the shot. <laughs> oh, I hit, I hit, he hit, he hit. Oh, he didn't even know that he hit him. Oh, he got him. Oh, he got Bobby! Bobby! Explosive damage from the Tempest is going in! That's what we like to see, Bobby. My guy. Uh, he goes, oh, I hit him. <laughs> yeah. I don't think I see him My guy, Marshy, dipped. He did not want that fight. He's over by the zip line. Okay. I think Sun might actually target him. Okay. Is this target Bobby's Marshy? first kill of the game? Of the tournament? Of the game? Yeah, I'm not sure about the tournament. It could be. Okay. I'm going to say that's his first. Yeah. Yeah. That's Bobby's first ki uh, kill. He's all smiles now. And what a kill yeah. it is. <laughs> Tippis from up high in the chopper. Nice play there. They've got three total. It looks like what? They've got three uh, godly squad. There was one other team with three as well. Oh, no. Now we're going to go over to Aerith and Nikki's squad to see where they're set up. They already in a fight, in a, yeah. a firefight already. Mighty's dead. It's Aerith. The shotgun is out. The shotgun is out. The shotgun is out. The shotgun is out. Easy. For Aerith, but oh. from the side. Oh. Take Tonic and Kublai still alive. Now they should be geared up to take that first place position on the leaderboard. All they need is some placement points, and they'll I, swoop it right out at Noah and Citrus's fingertips. I didn't expect Kublai to be like messing up on these close range shotgun shots because yeah. he's, he's deadly with it. Yeah, you're spitting facts right there. That lower left region of the circle is looking. Mm. Pretty saturated with players. We got Sheesh and Val Valor play. <laughs> Who is Sheesh? I think that's um, <laughs> Godly. <laughs> yes, sir. Sheesh. Okay, God. What is that position? <laughs> Valor's joining yeah. soon. Okay. <laughs> uh, all right. I mean, it's a tournament. Right. They can do what they want. Whatever they feel is fit to do, you go for it. Uh, listen, it's a time to stretch your fingers. Yeah, yeah. Get, get prepared for the circle to get smaller. Maybe get a snack in, reload your water. Yeah. It's important to stay hydrated. But now it they're is. chilling, and you can see the 3P power there, just looking through the window, trying to spot. Ooh. Okay, so they're flying in. He Son sees him. Bobby, we've I'm seen some crazy plays. They're looking mm -hmm. to get in the mix. Uh, I, I want to listen to the comps. I want to hear how these guys are breaking it down and looking to take the fight. Oh, I don't think Let's hear it. Oh, there's people at church. Church, behind, behind, behind. He's so weak. Nice. Oh, that was beautiful. What a nice clutch up. That was beautiful. What a nice clutch up. Sun right there with the Annihilator no scope. Back to back. That was crazy. That was actually crazy. That was a good job. Six points straight away for Sun and Bobby. Plus Just a couple of places. That looking cool. <laughs> yes, sir. Up in the hill, it's Jim and Fantas. Let's see what's going on in the underground right here. This is huge for Sun and Bobby because they already have the one win. If they can win yep. here and put up eight plus kills, or what are they at five right now? Like, yeah. All right, no, he left. They they will be firmly in first place, I believe. Definitely. Like barely in zone. Hawks already talking about the zone. Well, we play he wants to get in. They don't know the guys around he's, here. He's, they have he's, no idea. 
He's someone you always want to have on your team. The cerebral player that, you know, when yeah. you're flying around and taking fight to fight, that guy that's like, guys, we should probably rotate. Probably focus on the yeah. circle at yeah, some I point. Need, I need one of those persons too, because yeah, I, I... Me too. I, I, me too. Uh, dude, the number of times I've like died to storm in a game because I've stopped paying attention and it's on me. I'm like, no! Believe it or not, Hawks was actually that guy. Me and him were teammates in Clyde Stop. 9, and he was that guy. Oh, he always <laughs> on the zone. That was him. He's I still take back everything good. I said. <laughs> He knows what's up, dude. He's been a pro BR player himself. He knows what to do in these scenarios. If I would, you know, I would take this fight right now if I was Sun. They got the Annihilator. They're looking good. Couple of hits coming in. One more, and he's got the kill. There it is. Fantas is down. It's a one v two situation. They can push. Sun he definitely looking? has some interesting loadouts. He's rolling with no AR. <laughs> The Annihilator Wait. might as well be like a god tier weapon, you know? It's it it God tier weapon in a god's weapon. hand, and but Bobby yes, and Son are looking to put this away. They're on a mm. rampage. I'll, I want to hear their comms again. There's a Hard. smoke lower on the hill. He's snowboarding away. He's not going to get away. No chance. Well, definitely oh. a chance. He gets away. <laughs> nice. I was done right there. I would kind of be annoyed. Yeah. I would have wanted to hit that final shot. It was close. It was close. But no cigar. Could blind Tectonica in the zone, though. No. This, this is the battle of the top two teams yeah. now that Noah and um, Citrus are out. Let, let's see if Kublai can, like, redeem himself. Oh, by the hill there. Yeah. <laughs> After the Aerith choke, huh? Yeah, yeah. Of course. Hawkstairs has the zone positioning. <laughs> Always, dude. Always I'm telling good. you. You know what it is when it comes to zoning. Are they getting a fight? Are they getting a fight right now? I don't know what Ooh. him is doing. If I would have been gone ages ago. Again. Yeah. Oh no. Bro, the shot. The shotguns are out. Let me tell you. Sniper behind you. Sniper behind you. He's going into Hawk's Nest right now. This is exactly where we just seen Hawk's Nest. I'm like, yeah. 30 seconds ago, right in this building. They're probably waiting in there. They're probably he's, waiting he's in this building. He's going to throw that cluster. He throws it oh, right, right away. <laughs> oh! Oh, oh my. One pump. Oh, one pump. That, that oh. has to be the worst feeling right there. Can Hawk's Nest clutch it up here, though? Hawks is nervous, I can tell, dude. Oh, I, I know saw, he's assuming why he sent it. Like, if, like, why didn't they both send it? If they're going to fly, like, you can't, I don't know, send one. Yeah. Is I, there, know, I know, right? Uh, he, he's, he's pushing up. I think Hawks is going to get that one shot. Hawks is going to get that one shot. No! <laughs> the movement from Hawks was not there, oh, dude. Oh, my that is gosh. Not called mobile BR. You need to be fast and aggressive. You right. Can't around the okay. right. <laughs> Marcy is also around... Jim right now, just below him, and I believe. And the fact that he yes, heard he the shotgun, power. he should have been more prepared. 100%, I completely agree with you. Yeah, like that, that, that was like the worst right positioning to yeah. deal with a shotgun after your teammate gets yep. one pumped. Mm -hmm. Let's see if Jim can still use that shotgun to take out Godsley here and Valor. Ooh. He, he's not leaving that tower. That's yeah, his new I home. wouldn't leave that tower either, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't leave that tower until I have to. I don't know. If he should oh, be jumping going up top. Right oh, I think he's trying to get up top. Oh, he, he made okay. it. He could probably kill Sun and Bobby right oh. here as well. Oh, he just hit Sun. Oh. Yeah. He did just hit him. Sun with the annihilator shots through the smoke. Come on, he's got to connect one of them. There you go, finally. A couple of these look oh. good. There it is. Yeah, there yeah, yeah. Uh, poor Marshy. We'll see you later. Gone, but not, not forgotten. Oh, Sun has five kills right now. No, That's yeah, this, this is the game where they, they could massively take the lead. I mean, they already Honestly. should, just based on, what, what, getting into the top three now. Yeah, yeah. But if they can get the win as well, get all those extra points, but we got to go back to Jim. The crazy plays with the shotgun. Oh, Jim is up. Oh, what, what's going to happen here? Oh, oh my God, oh, Jim. God. You got to go, Jim. Jim is trying to shoot the wall. I don't think it worked that way. Oh, my God. Godsley's pushing. Oh, Godsley with a shotgun. Oh, oh. A lot of mistakes. What? 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 Oh my god! Oh, Jim's gone. Finally. Jim is gone. Godzi is going off with that shotgun. <sighs> I thought it was going to end badly right there, but good stuff. I believe it's a 2v2v1. Uh, Bobby, I don't know who's one in. Oh, is, it, is that Sun? I think that's Sun, yeah. That's his teammate. Yeah, yeah. I thought Bobby, Bobby was going to try hard mode. <laughs> All right. 
Oh, they're, gonna win, Bobby, Bobby win they're gonna win this. Bobby with the third. They're gonna win this. Sun's on six. Give him number seven. Uh, Bobby is like down. Oh, he's down. Yep. Yeah, Bobby's down. Yeah. One versus one. Right up. Tap, tap, tap. Oh. He got Let's worked. Go. He got oh, worked. Bobby. Let's go, Bobby. Right Let's go, go, Bobby. Big game right there, Bobby. Big game right there, Bobby. Oh. Son Let's go, Bobby. Fantastic yeah. end was, game play. Was, was, Bobby. Eight kills for Sun, two for Bobby. I it's think that so... puts him on top, right? Yeah, it's got to. We're gonna. Well, we'll wait a minute here to look at the overall leaderboard. But fifty point game, ten kills from Bobby and Son. If Bobby was hit to like, I didn't see what his HP with the end was, but he got shot first. He was weak. A nice movement, nice shotty play. Is Son the best player in the game? Maybe. Definitely Maybe. And dude, he's disgusting. The guy is absolutely nasty. But as we check out the overall game three results, we're now over halfway through. And the big thing there at 11th, you see Noah in Citrus. They only got 15 points, which is better than a lot of teams. But for a team that was in, well, first and battling for like a top three, that one's going to hurt him. Watching Bobby and Son get so many points on the board. But what a ridiculous ending it was to the game. Three filled with insane moments. I'm going to check out some of the highlights from that wild finish. I have a nade there. I'm going wide left. Yeah, on me. That's not sexy on me. Yeah, we're king. Someone's here. Oh no, no. I'm getting shot, I'm getting shot. No, I'm me, I'm me, I'm me, I'm me. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Get him, finish it, finish it. Nice, nice, nice. Just got on top of the hill. Uh, he was just running past. Okay. Yeah. Look. There's one. We can count that tag. He's down to the right. Nope. Nice. Very there nice. we go. There's another team of over. I backed him down. Nice. Got to get on top. Vehicle. Yes. Yep. Nice. That's huge. You want to grab it? Or... What? Right there, right there. Nice. They're definitely here. I got him. Just one guy. Ooh, that one close. close. Beautiful, beautiful. You hit him, you hit him. Oh, did I hit him? You hit him, you hit him. Oh, I got him. Nice. That's bowling. Let's go, Bobby. Oh, there's people at church. Church, behind, behind, behind. He's so weak. Nice. Nice, Bobby. Adrenaline. Wait, oh. That one bottom bridge. Watch your top bridge. I smoke him out. Let's go, oh, Bobby! Let's go, Bobby! Let's go, Bobby! Let's go, Bobby! Before we review the standings, here's a little taste of the newest show on the Cobb Mobile Esports channel. What's good, everybody? We're back with another Call of Duty mo Wait. I don't... Where did that come from? That is not a painting, and it definitely looks like it could fall on my head. Okay. I guess this will work. Welcome everybody. We are here with the first ever. Yeah, I'm like some good TV. Oh, 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 Okay, wow, uh, some spectacular, sensational, incredible moments from that game three, but all that matters is where that put everyone in the standing. So let's check it out and see where we're at as the teams move up the rankings. But the big thing here, Bobby and Son with that monster win, eight points clear of second place. And Ferg, they're looking good to make a run. They're looking fantastic to make a run. Like we were saying before, they had a swing game, dude. They were already top three. They pushed themselves right up into the first place position, overtaking Noah and Citrus. And Tectonic overtook them as well. It's incredible. It's incredible. Now, Kyle, if you see it right now, there are what, t three teams kind of in the hunt, like between 101 and 80. I I'm going to ask you, of everyone below that, like from fourth and on, who do you think has the best chance to really jump up into that mix? Hmm. Um. I would say, I would say probably. Uh, I'm. I'm not even sure, but I would say probably. Um. Hawks and uh, and Rosie because they were playing a pretty good game until it ended badly. So let's see. Really good. Yeah. Shotgun. Yeah. 
All right. Well, I mean, that's a, that's the safe answer, right? They're they're in fourth place. They definitely have the best chance to do it. I'm just curious if anyone maybe further down the board can get one of those huge games that propels them to the top. But yeah. that's a look at the standings after three games. We only have two more to play. Remember, it's a combination of their their placements, combination of the kills, everything adding up to see who's going to take home the largest chunk of this prize pool. But we're going to go right into our game. Here we go. Game four, where champions are made and losers are slayed yeah thank you thank you for, for I, I didn't know where i was gonna go with that at all but kyle Good i want to ask you i mean citrus has been hot off the drop right like he's gotten i think two first kills through three games can he do it again let's see let's see hopefully we see them jumping at the platform again and some other teams it's kind of further this time so i'm interested to see how many people are actually going to go there Facts, it's looking like it's Noah and Citrus combined oh, with Extreme to Tio and Envoy and Moralto all going to platform again. No, it's, it's about to be a hot drop. This is what I live this for, guys. This is going to be you. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. If you're a BR player, that's exactly what you want to see at the start of a game. Honestly. Right, give me the action and give it to me early. You win those fights, it can set you up for the whole game. But what do you know? And Ooh. Citrus again gets the first frag. The man has been Oops, a monster totally in the monster. early moments. Oh, no one dead already, though. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, he was so hyped for that. He was so <laughs> hyped for that. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> okay, we got Bobby and Sun again. Ooh. Ooh. Nice, nice. Nevada took. No, this is big, though, boys, because. This is huge. That is huge. Bobby and Sun are out. So they were in first place, up eight points, popping off after that monster game. It's, we saw that happen last time. Like, yeah. what, the team that dominated the second game went out early in the third. So there's openings for these other yeah, squads to, to move up the ranks. Yeah, we're definitely picking up a trend here. It's anybody's game. <laughs> that is detrimental. No points for game four. Oh, my. That is awful. Oh, we got a fight here. Someone's on low HP. All right. The pop-off games are great, but it's yeah. the it's the yeah, consistency, consistency, man. Avoiding those sure. early deaths, especially with how much kills are worth. Yeah, yeah. An early death like that. Nevada and Bougie are actually good. pushing away. They don't want this fight. Thank you. That's Ooh. what I'd be doing. Good teammate coming through right there with the adrenaline as well. Gotta love that. Let's check out Sanitarium here. Do you see anything oh. from the overall like map there, Kyle? Anything that stood out? Nothing crazy. I, I, I don't even remember. I'm I'm just hooked in the action right now. <laughs> I don't even remember. We got Citrus, Citrus and Noah, looking pretty neat on the field. I might add, in his tuxedo. <laughs> Extreme just dipped. He didn't want that fight, but Citrus is right after him, dude. He Switching. wants it. Straight up. I see an airboy up there too. To be honest, I think I would do the exact same. No one high, much yeah. lower points extreme has. Oh, he's, he's trying. He's trying to get away. He's like, go, let's go. go. I don't know that language, but I'm pretty sure he said, "Let's go, let's go, let's go." Yeah, I, for I, sure. I would imagine. With Citrus hunting you down, get out of there. He's got the revive flame team coming in as well. He does not want that smoke from Citrus. I'll tell you that. And then Noah's teammates coming back, or Citrus is made. Noah come back in. Yeah, yeah. Citrus pushing up on the platform here. Yes, sir. Still a firefight to be oh. had. Oh. I like that. Nice back down. Looked to re-engage. Didn't have good position. And how clutch has Citrus been? This is multiple times we've seen him like last alive. Get Noah 100%. back in the action. Yeah. He oh. the gunfight. Dude, it, it's like last time on the mountain, man. He gets out of there. His buddy, his he gets his teammate there. back. He ends up getting two kills. Like he's been clutching up. Yeah, bro. All right, Noah and Citrus here just saying, "Yo, we 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 clear the platform. This is our place." And Citrus again, dude. He's on three. Like, I think it was the same thing last game and the game before, where he just has so many kills in the early going. It's huge for them. 100% and the first kill every game for the last three games. That's 27 points as a solo player, <laughs> right? They think that's absurd. I jumped, I jumped. Oh, back on board with hockey. I like this. 
Uh, drop at Kill House. See yeah. what's going to do here. Fly to that or not? I love his voice and like just how like calm it seems and <laughs> I'm sure it's panicky, but it's like soothing. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I kind of want him to like yeah. narrate my life. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel that. Aerith is looking for a kill on the good old Marshy. He spotted him. With that AK spray? I hate him. No hits. You did say you hit him. I, I, yeah, I think she said I hit him. I don't know if you did. Yeah, yeah there's, nah. there is no hits right there. I, I saw a hit marker. <laughs> that's oh, just bro. a lie. That's like your teammate that goes, he's one shot, he's one What's shot. That? Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. I was like, bro, she's going to call like one shot right here. <laughs> Marshy doing tricks on the board. Ooh, there's Path up on the side of the building. Marshy scooted past him, though. Going back to his teammate now. Bolo and Marshy might be able to make something happen this game. We haven't seen too much from him, though, this entire tournament. They got the chopper. They're looking to take the fight. And Kyle, how, how much does it help to have the mobility of the chopper and just be able to circumvent the map and rotations, get to different fights? It's got to be huge, right? Yeah, it's definitely huge. It's really, I just said, the best vehicle that you just want to travel via helicopter all the time. It gets you around and, you know, it's just good. It's whether you can maintain control of it, I guess. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Pretty sure Jim and Fantas has spotted Hawks and Rosie right here. Hawks just picked up his loadout weapon, so he could be able to get some nice snipes Ooh. in. Oh, Rosie's yeah, yeah, got a yeah. sniper too. Hit it. Oh my. Hit the shot. Did, did Hit Jim it. have a sniper? I think they have the, the, the um, advantage. Jim has an HVK and a shotgun. I think oh, Fantas no. has the sniper though, for yeah, sure. I think they're moving away. They don't want this fight against... No Fantas. chance. This has been a much more slow game, yeah. I feel like. People are taking it a little bit more passively. They want to secure good points. It's it's, it's a very important game, so I, I imagine like that they're trying to just be playing with the strategy. You think that's what it is? Yeah, like it's, not, it's not like drop related or circle related. It's just uh, the pressure's on. Yeah, aside from Noah and Stitches, yeah, I think everyone's thinking yeah. that. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. Yeah, the circle does leave a lot of the map open though, so I agree, Maven. It could be a little bit to do with the circle as well. You know, me getting blown up with vehicles. Now. <laughs> My guy, Lil B. I'm hoping to see something from them, man. Lil B loves multiplayer. I want to see some multiplayer players pop off. At least once. <laughs> For the one time? Well, I don't think he's going to shot on anyone out of the chopper. All right, Mod 6, listen. This is the time where you you step up for me. And you make a, a game-winning play. Just absolutely fry. You put that bald, bearded power... Into the mix. <laughs> uh, we're, uh, we're, we're gone. Yeah. The bold bearded bush boys. Let's go. Oh, oh he's back. Let's see what's going to yeah. happen. Ooh. Ooh, oh, they got FHJ. FHJ. Oh, they no. to get Is he that. not going to jump? Is he not going to oh. jump? Oh, they, oh, they jumped. They got Good. it. I've been seeing a lot of trucks lately. I'm not sure I like it. Oh. Team E and Team 3 are riling up against each other right here. All it's right. Lil B. Oh, we got Carson and Gemini here. Are they going to push? Come on! No! Ah, oh. Back onto Maven V2. Yeah. Oh. Hit it. Ooh. Come on. Oh, Come on. no, no. Oh, he's no. dead, bro. Oh, that was Citrus. Oh. Even a Annihilator, Annihilator. Too. Not even a sniper. Honestly, I think they should just push that and kill them both right here. Yeah. That should be, like, the easiest kill ever. We'll probably see them on the kill feed, I'd assume. Sometime very, very soon. Ooh. As Little B gets knocked! No, no. Noah got mod 6. I feel like we're seeing a lot more sniper plays suddenly. Yes, sir. Hawks is pushing in. Confirming that kill. I'm going to smoke the back of it. Goodbye, little bee. Gone but not forgotten. Hopping on board with Team 4. It's Nevada. We got some shotgun action going on. Oh. Poojie got one. It's Can I get the second? Yeah, Tillo kills oh. Poojie. He's going to clutch oh. it. Oh. <laughs> Nevada, Nevada should have not. One. Yeah, yeah he should have not smoke bombed. He should have just went for the fight. That is oh. true. And that Path is, is dead. That's one of those deaths you're going to be real, real frustrated about. You yeah. just can't get smoked. Oh, yeah, yeah. As soon as your head rolls back and the hands go up in the air, yeah. Yeah, you just yeah. know you got smoked. <laughs> oh, no. Literally smoked.
Ooh, Godsley. Looking for a kill Ooh. on Shapito. It's my hog, the God Shotgunner user, though. And Ooh. he's got his favorite. The oh, he's got the ninja. He misses. he misses again. Oh. Shapito what is got this? him. Oh, Let's there go. we go. Good Let's stuff. Go. Barely. That, like, ended up being such a a beautiful, like, bait and switch because the yep. grapple threw. Like, it, it looked messy, but it actually kind of worked out perfectly for it them. It did work out perfectly, 100%. Tarzan and Noah. Yeah, Tarzan and Noah. Let's see what's going to happen. I think Citrus is close by, too. Oh, it's over. No. Tarzan <laughs> easily taken out right there. In, Insta kill. Carry here if you want it. Um, they probably do. Six adrenalines? Are you serious? Oh, it's sacking. <laughs> They could honestly pl play for loads of placement points right now, too. They really wanted to. They've already got three kills this game. Well, five, Actually, five, five kills. Right? Yeah, yeah. I think Noah, Noah and um, Citrus are definitely trying to make up for the last game. Max. Um, Tectonic well, has spotted and, someone, though. And Sun and Bobby going out so early. Like, yeah, this is their chance. Yeah, like, yeah. get right back into first place. It looks and like Tectonic and Kubli want it. That's why the difference is going to be huge, though. Like, I, if... if if a team like Citrus Squad ends up winning this, like I, they're gonna win it. I bet the point differential will come from those first kills. I'm not even kidding. Yeah, like, yeah those 100%. Nine points. I think that was their game plan going in, seeing how they're playing. Yeah, drop well, platform, hot drop, get the first he kill. Has, I think he has three out of four. So yeah, I, I, <laughs> it, it definitely distinctly seems like he's going for that. And yeah. it looks like they got a six kill now. So Citrus and Nella, pop it off. There's a lot of teams around that top left side of the. New zone. Yeah, Loads of choppers too. No, with Lots of ability. Can you get a hit though? A legendary. Ooh. Ooh. Come on, Noah. We want to see it. Oh, that's a perfect snipe. Come on. Yeah. Hit him. Oh no. Oh, he get got a hit. Once. Second time. Oh, one more is all you need. If he's able to hit him right now, that would be epic. He can do it. He can do it. it. Oh, he's, he got his shot right there. Come on. Oh. Nice. Good stuff. Oh, good sniping right there. I see what you mean, though. Do you need adrenaline, by the way? It takes a lot of hits. It does, and that's the most powerful sniper. That's the legendary Arctic. Well, what's crazy about it is how, how fast it shoots, though. Like, it almost oh, has yeah. to take multiple yeah. hits, considering you can just keep tapping. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. you can spam it with minimal recoil as well. Yeah, definitely my favorite sniper. I think we're going to hop on board with Aerith and Nicole and see what they're doing right now. I believe Team Seven somewhere nearby. Oh my gosh, he's crawling really? up the steps. They're, well, come on, what's it's, going it, on here, Aerith? Hey, hey, very tactical. Very, very tactical. Very tactical moves. All right. Oh, it gets a snowboard too. <laughs> <laughs> a nice aerial view of the map. You love to see it. Oh, they're trying to make really their like way this to this map, zone. like in general. Like I like it a lot. Yeah, it's a uh, very good map. I mean, it's not my favorite. But it does have some good spots. See, yeah, I haven't played as much, but I guess, like, I don't know. I love, as soon as I heard, like, Call of Duty was going to be making BRs in general, it just sounded so cool to me because oh, all yeah. of the history and decades of Call of Duty and all the different maps you could put in from the past. Like, there's just, like, a playground of Call of Duty history to put in yeah. these BRs. It's yeah. awesome. Yeah, My favorite yeah. BR map is actually Alcatraz. I love Alcatraz. Yeah, I think it's a fun. great map. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Or what is it now? Rebirth, Resurgence, the island? Yeah. No, That's what not. it is on uh, Warzone. Yeah, it's nuts. It's nuts. Yeah. Oh, they've spotted him. Okay. I don't even think. Yeah. Oh, he slayed him out. Oh. That's it. Gone. Jokester. Chip terminal is almost ready. Wait, so there's only what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven teams remaining. This has uh, turned into a massacre. Yeah. I feel Oops, like it, it seems. He just so. jumped. Like it hasn't been as crazy as maybe the last game, but people are still dropping. Yeah, yeah. The circle it started slow. Well, we might have more teams than ever, like in these like, late circle scenarios. We'll yep. see, but Ooh. I don't know about after this. What Ooh. you say, the shotgun god. Yeah. Trying to go deep. I want him He's to clutch it. get away right now. Yes, sir. Oh. Whoa. Oh, my. Headshot. He just yeah, peaked, his head bro. just got <laughs> bopped off. Oh. I, can, I can barely see him. Well, that guy can't see anymore either because his head's gone from a shotgun. <laughs> Fags. No! Oh, one, six. I was just yeah. saying Noah clutching up. Okay, 1v1. Nice, dude. And they got it. Well played. 
Good stuff. I feel like the early game of this was slow, but mid game has been fired wait, up. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. There's no barely any teams. Storm. Noah and Citrus are on 10. There's okay. still 14 people in the game. Whoa. I mean, this could end up being like a 15 kill dub or something if they, uh, if they manage to win. Yeah. They keep it going. Tectonic yeah, they're still gonna him. win though. <laughs> Thanks. But regardless, I mean, you have what? Uh, 27 plus the nine point. I mean, you've got a 36 point game already without a, any kind of yeah. placement points. Yeah, that's yeah. that's very good for them. Tectonic and Kublai have actually landed near a team right here. I'm not sure where the guy was. Oh, he sees him. He's right around the corner of that house. Shots Ooh. coming down. Couple of misses. Is Movement is incredible right here. Oh, he finally no. hit the shot. Citrus goes down. It's all down to Noah. Kublai and Tectonic 1v2 situation. If Noah clutches this up, like that's a dub Definitely. in its own right. My Hawk the shotgun guard's still oh, in a 1v2 situation no. against Hawk's Nest and his brother. Oh it's, it's my over. God. That's the, that was a nasty shotgun kill. I feel like I cursed Noah and Citrus. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think Noah uh, could clutch I, a 1v2. I was just gassing him up and saying how important this could be. And then they, yep. so you lose Citrus. But yeah, Noah's still got a shot. I mean, think about it. He, I feel like he owes Citrus one. Citrus has so many clutches to get him back. Like, this is Noah's time. Yeah, I agree. No pressure. <laughs> Prime time to shine for Noah right here. I think we're about to stream and to Tio. This is probably the longest I've lasted. <laughs> I don't think they know that they're right behind them. Just peacefully looting. Oh, they know now. Oh, and no. he's gone. <laughs> like <laughs> lions stalking their prey. All right, oh, it's all over. It's over. That's it. It's all gone. Get an annihilator, this guy. Pick it up, Hawks. I believe Noah must have glided across the map. Because he started at the bottom instead of the top yeah, where he was I, before. Yeah, I was literally about to say, where, how did Noah get there? Yeah, All right. I wonder if they're running airborne. There must be one of them. Slay Ooh. coming in. Kubai's out. First kill. Can she pick up Tectonic, though? He's a go oh. in his own right. <laughs> get this 1v2, oh. Yaris. He's excited for those hits. Let's see if we can yeah. catch it up. I want to see it happen. Tectonic's Aerith. gone. Yeah, Aerith versus the multiplayer lord. Yeah, <laughs> fags. Ooh. Nice double hit. Is this Tectonic? Oh, oh Tectonic is out. Both. He was in between both teams. Oh, yeah. well, that, there he goes. That's a tough spot. Aerith's still here. Fortunate. Looking around. We've got to push up. We've got to get this high ground up in. I wouldn't want nothing there. Got... It's not far from Noah getting decent Relax. placement points, just staying alive. Really good yeah. placement points already. Only seven left. Yeah. Oh, the big push on Aerith is here. What's going to happen? Oh. Can she clutch it up? Oh. oh. No, looking she likely. Not. Every kill we've seen from Jim's POV is it's just shot. popping someone with a shoddy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It was a Ryan I think we have though. just three teams left in this game right now. Yeah. Oh no. No, it's not a good spot. Oh no. no I mean, no, there's a well. Oh, he <laughs> crashed. Oh no. That's it. It's over. No. Oh, I'm in the chat for no right now. They, well, they still might get the most points in this game, though. Like, yeah. yeah. Just I would have said so for sure. Uh, they still did very well. Airborne? Oh, high ground. Mm -hmm. Jim's oh, got the annihilator. That no, that's easy pickings. That's easy pickings for my guy, Jim, if he just hits the shot. Oh, Come no. on, dude. Guarantee yourself the kills. I think all of the bigger teams are out, if you guys realize. They are. Every single one. Noah was last alive out of the biggest yeah. teams. Then Tech and, I mean, Bobby and my guy's son were right at the start. So oh, that's no. not looking too hot for them. Well, that makes me, yeah, just really curious how... The standings will look when this is done. If they, if the gap has been closed a little bit between yeah. like the top three and the rest, this could be huge Indeed. for Hawks' squad, hundred percent. Yeah, because they were what fourth. Yeah, they were fourth. Yeah, I think they had fifty points. Yeah. And Rosie got one. Ooh. Is he he marked the second. He's gonna get both. They're inside. Of each other. <laughs> oh no! Oh my! Is Hawks, Hawks gonna clean up? Nice. Nice. Is it? Is that it for the team? Oh. Oh. No. Nope, no. Nope, no. Nope. Where did that person even go? Oh. Yeah, he just used the tree. Nice That's some OP plays right oh, there. He's trying to ninja that one tree. 1v1. 1v1. 
Fantastic. And this is fairly weak. Uh, let's see what Hawks, Hawks, Hawks is going to do here. here you I feel like Hawks should have pushed that, man. He yeah. already made him weak with the Annihilator Never show. question I... Hawks' brain. <laughs> He's a cerebral player and he's gonna clutch this right, one let's on see, one. Let's see. Hawks with the tag. Oh, he hit him twice. The armor's broken. Push it, Hawks. Oh, push it. Oh my <laughs> God. <laughs> In the middle of the tournament, Hawks. Oh no, he's dead, bro. There's no shot. He's gone. Oh no. Let's go. Oh no. Let him go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let him be kidding. He Did he just get low power in the middle of a one on one? That is that is, uh, that is just a classic mobile moment right there. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Should have been charging. He should have been charging. So it ends up being Jim and Fantas that'll take the first place spot in that particular game. But when you look at the overall points, yeah, it's Noah and Citrus just behind the yep. nine kills. They got the first one as well. Citrus has been a beast in that regard. Um, well, 37 points for Hawks and Rosie. So that's to move them up the leaderboard a little bit. But Kyle, I guess that game seemed a little bit, the pacing was a little different than some of the others. Yeah, it was definitely more slow paced. I'm not sure what if the zone had a thing to do with that, like Ferg said, but I think some of the teams were just a little bit nervous in getting taken out early because right now it is do or die. So yeah. A hundred percent, but like Ferg, that's also like the fun thing about a BR because even if it is a little slow at the beginning, uh, it the circle is going to force it to eventually get yep. frantic. There will always be a particular point in a game of BR where it's, really exciting it was just a different play style this game than compared to the last also bottom of the leaderboard for this game bobby and son zero Ooh. points yeah that is uh that is huge i can't wait to can't wait to check out the leaderboard and see where this landed everybody but as that gets tallied we're going to toss you guys to an awesome highlight video from game four oops i fell all the way down i killed someone oh, yeah. i'm going i'm going i'm leaving I'm somebody else Son. Nice, nice, nice. Yo, yo, it's so much sniping from you. Let's go! Let's go! Oh, swimming, swimming. Nice. Nice. Hurry up. Leave this smoke. Oh, yeah. Nice. 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 Yeah, I got a lot of shots on. Oh, nice. Oh, that's good. Engaging the enemy. Enemy down. Come on, come on, come on. We've got no reload, death and Maddie. Well played, bro. Come on. Before we review the standings, let's take a look at some of the childhood photos of the participants playing in today's tournament. All right, guys, now I know, I know we're having a lot of fun on the map as people are flying and frying with the shotgun popping off, but now we're, gonna, now we're gonna play a little game. We've got some childhood pics of some of the people involved in this particular tournament, and this is gonna be called Who Is It? Now, what's gonna happen here is I have picked five images of the various people, and now for Ferg and Kyle, you guys are gonna have to guess who is on the screen. Now, let's start off, let's, let's show the first picture. We'll show the first picture, and. Kyle, since uh, you're incredible uh, and, you know, you're one of the most talented people in the world, you're going to start off. So, Kyle, who do you think is the first picture? Um, This one is very hard. I know I'm incredible and one of the most talented people in the world, but um, <laughs> like this one is hard. I'm I'm going to I think this is a bad guess, but I'm going to go with I'm going to go with Hawks Nest. <laughs> OK, all right. You're going you're going Hawks. You're going Hawks. All right, Ferg, you're up the bat. Listen, I'm a, I'm going to be pretty analytical with this. Because I also am an incredible person, an incredible what, player forensics? myself. Like what? Listen, dude, this face is shiny. It's a shiny face. And the only person I, that comes to mind when I think of shiny faces is, is Bobby Plays. It's got to be Bobby. He's got a little shiny peck on his nose. His cheeks are rosy red, like how they get when he gets mad at playing the game. Like, it's Bobby. That has to be Bobby Plays. How close are you and Bobby? I mean, I talked to him a, a fair amount. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, okay. Well, you're right. Ding, ding, ding. You got the first one Shame. right. It is one zero. Oh, Berg, uh, is he is some sort of scientist or uh, police? I, I don't know. I don't know what that was, but great, great job on the first one. All right, let's take a look at our second photo now. And uh, Berg, as you were able to win that particular duel, you were up first. Who is it? I judging by the nose, I'm gonna have to say that that's Godsley. 
Uh, a child should not be driving a tractor. That's for that's sure. That's actually true. That's, I don't know who let him on the tractor. That's for sure. <laughs> All right, so sorry. What was it again? What was your guess? I'm going... Uh, it's between... It's got to be Godsley. It's got to be Godsley. Okay, you're going Godsley. Kyle. I think it doesn't... I think it definitely has to be Godsley. It definitely has to yeah. be Godsley. I well, know this well, area. <laughs> guess what? What? You're both wrong. No, I'm, I'm kidding. You're, oh. both right. You're both right. You're both right. You're oh, both right. Oh, I was the right. same. All right, Ferg. Ferg. Ferg's still up. Still up. Two to one. Let's go to our third image. Our third image. And uh, oh, I, I know can't... this. Oh, this is so easy. Oh, uh, yeah. This is a free double. Are you the yeah. base expert? This is so I think I got this one, too. It's so obvious on the left side. All right. Just uh, it, it, Okay, wait, wait. Then you, If you think you know, then Kyle, go first. Oh my god, I'm going with Hawks again. I'm going with Hawks again. Okay, you're going Hawks, Ferg? It's Hawks Nest 100%. Okay. <laughs> it's Hawks Nest. I, no did, I, didn't know, I didn't know he was the karate kid. But yes, you're both right. Uh, Hawks is the correct answer. Uh, and that'll be three to two to Ferg. Let's take a look at the fourth. As we continue on. Oh, oh my oh. god, I think I know I this know one. <laughs> I know this one. <laughs> Oh, Kyle? I'm gonna go with Noah. I <laughs> agree. I agree. It just okay. it looks like you, Noah did. You guys are too good at this. It's Noah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do you guys like look at baby pictures all the time? What? No, you no. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. The forehead Noah. is like it's it's like it marks Noah. <laughs> it's yeah. a trademark. Okay. Uh, you guys, you guys are incredible. You're in the wrong line of work. You should you should have done something. If, and, I don't Maybe know. A detective. I, I have no idea. A detective. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Thank you. NCI Miami or NCIS. What is it? I don't even know. There's like 40 of those shows and 40 million people watch them a week. Um, all right. So it's right now three to two. No, it's four to four. Wait, to three. Four, sorry, four, four to four three. three. Yeah, yeah. Three in favor of Ferg. I, I, I think we have one final photo, though. I think we have one final photo. And Kyle, this is your... This is your chance, Kyle. Oh my God, who could this be? Okay, that, that, oh that, my that, God, who that, could this be? Dude. Okay, that's uh, this is gonna be the. Uh, <laughs> that is definitely you, you, Ferg. You this is definitely <laughs> Ferg. Uh, come on, yes, dude. tell us a story, uh, Ferg. We need to know. Yeah, no, did you fall down a flight of steps, sir? <laughs> <laughs> my mom dropped me, dude. Oh no, in that oh, is it th kidding. those stairs? <laughs> Cute kid. All right, well, Ferg is a champion, and uh, Ferg, I'd like to congratulate you. You have won absolutely nothing. Uh, oh, I'll take some nothing. Yeah, yeah I got I a whole bunch of nothing, too, so I'm okay. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. No, we all tied that. I don't think there's money or anything involved in that. All right, well, that's going to do it for our Who Is It segment with the childhood photos is uh, they show some unreal talent there to figure it out. But let's get back into the gameplay. Let's get it rolling. What a wild finish to that fourth game. It was just absolute insanity at the end of that one. But now what we've been waiting for, let's check out the standings because there has got to be some movement. And what do you know? Noah and Citrus going to move themselves up into first place with all of those kills going huge. And well, the, the first entry kills as well. Tectonic and Kublai, Bobby and Sun will round out the top three. And then Hawks and Rosie, they're still right there, still just behind but this is it boys this is the final game we're gonna see who's gonna go huge because it feels like any of what four teams probably have a really good chance to take this whole thing for 100 percent. it looks like from hawks nest and up all have a chance to win this game if they just drop me i mean hawks and rosie are slightly lower than the rest of the pack but they are just behind bobby and son we're talking 14 points Behind. So if Bobby and Son decide to just go ahead and kill themselves at the start of the game again, I think Hogsnest and Rosie will go straight into the third spot. And to be honest, I feel like the fight between Noah and Tectonic's team could get pretty juicy towards the end of this match because I don't think those guys are going to die at the start of a game. Well, it's interesting you missed, mentioned those two teams now because, Kyle, we're going to talk about something we're going to be doing for the final game. Something special. A little extra cash up for grabs. It's called the Kingslayer Hunt. There's going to be a $250 reward for each kill on any of the listed players. Now, why this is pretty interesting as we look at these teams is because, well, Noah and Citrus and Tectonic and Kublai and Bobby and Sun round out the six players. So I guess, Kyle, I want to hear your thoughts. Like, is do you think people, especially maybe at the bottom, if you don't have a lot of points, you're not making much money, like, you're going to be going after these guys to make some extra cash. Definitely, because at this point, it, it's it's like your only chance to get some bucks right now. So I definitely right. think this is a this is always a great idea to add this in the game here. And yeah, I want to see how it's going to turn out because the top four right now are 
are like battling it out it's definitely do or die if it wasn't before so yeah this should be a very interesting play out here no matter the result 100 percent. and like yeah now it's like you know if you're no one citrus and you kill one of those teams uh not only do you give yourself a better chance of taking the whole thing but then you also get a little extra cash on top of it so exactly. we'll have to keep an eye on that and uh, see how it's going to play out but it is time the final game let's get it rocking Everybody loves the final game. All the pressure on. This is the time. Who's going to go big? And I'm just wondering, by the way, Citrus has already guaranteed himself $1,000 because he got, no one could get more first kills than him. He already has three. There's only five games. He's done it. Kyle, is he going to get a fourth? I, I think he will. I think he will. At this point, he's just the first kill god. <laughs> Yeah, he really is, right? But I'm also and, thinking, and, like, you're in first place. It's the final game. Do you need to be that aggro? Like, in early death here? No, because they're not going to do it. Look, they didn't go platform. They're it's, securing the, the early oh, their early life. They don't want to die fast. They went middle map. They're not oh, going platform I actually, again. I actually thought that they were the team that went there. So I was like, they're really no. putting a lot of risk here. No chance. They're playing passive, I think, this game. It's, it's weird, though, because it's like, you know, I get it. Like, you want to play, you want to play more passive, but at the same time, it's like, did Bobby and Sun? Yeah, but, but Bobby and Sun went the platform. I think to kill Noah and Citrus because they knew that Noah and Citrus went there, oh. and then they went there this game, and Noah and Citrus weren't there. I think Bobby and Sun were playing to take down Noah and Citrus early, and it hasn't panned out in their favor because Noah oh, is not point. there. Yeah, that's a good point. Like, oh, we got a shotgun oh, here. Oh dear. Oh no. Bro. Oh that is, no. That was oh, bad from Sun no. right there. Yeah, that was bad. Were not good. Confirmed. Oh no. Tatilo with the first frag. Not gonna be happy with that. Yeah, that's tough. I mean, he's been playing so well. We watched a lot of him yeah. like that. That was just shaky shots, unfortunately, in the most important game. That is true. Ooh. <laughs> Morato going down here, I think. Yep. Basically right where the teammate was. He's Crawl. Right left. He's right, right on my body, right on my body, right on my body. I would like to say no, that in VR setting, I, I have the best, I have the best communication in the world when I'm knocked. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm much firing my info. <laughs> what else can you do? <laughs> I would get this full kill. Why is he doing? Yeah, why is he not confirming? Okay. Finally. He heard you. Yeah. Kind of awkward right there, bro. I was like, dude, you should probably confirm those three points. You never know if you go in the money or not. Definitely. Yeah. Given their positioning too, it is definitely something they should have done. Well, circle's gonna Bobby. be pulling pretty far south, but there, there's yeah. still a lot of people. A lot of people on the north side of the map. Bobby's gone. He does not want to fight anyone when Sun's yeah. dead. Sun's he's coming just, back he's in right too. He's right on the top right. <laughs> yeah, back up to Antarctica right there. Look at the focus. He just wants to stay alive. Chilling. Just let me know where you're going. Oh, oh, he, he just breathed a sigh of relief right there. <laughs> Yeah. You don't want to be taking fights in this game mode as a solo. That's no true. shot. <clears throat> it looks like there's a fight over in Sanitarium. From what yeah. I know, Godsley has been over in Sanitarium quite a lot this entire tournament, so it could be them. And it is them, Godsley oh, and Valor. No. I think they went there for the secret room. They like yeah, the that's a there. fact. With the guaranteed vest. I can make it to you. You gonna fight? I'm pushing. We have some tactical plays going going in here. Until they drop. They hear me. They hear me. Drop the me. Drop the me. Oh, Fowler. nice drop shot. Destroy Why did you pick out Gemini? Oh, in instantaneous destruction right there. Unfortunate for young Gemini. But farm looks like it's pretty packed full of players right here. We yeah, got three teams, I think, in the same kind of area. Yeah, Pass team with up. little B. We got Jokester in there. It's looking like it's just two teams instead of three. I think Farmers Farmers had the best fights like the entire tournament. It's just a great place to have some fights. Yeah, well, farm and like, platform. It just reminds me of like a multiplayer farm. map. Like it's just yeah. I, I don't know, like one to two story buildings, some open spaces. Like it's yeah. just I don't know. It's a fun place to fight. Little kind of reminds me of a map in uh, Call of Duty history known as Overgrown. That's the kind of vibe I get when I'm running around and farm. Yeah, it's like a, yeah, no, I feel like a smaller version of that in a way. I had spent yeah. some, a lot of time on that. Well, I asked you earlier, how difficult is it to rip somebody out of a chopper? They're, they're just pelting it. Yeah. yeah, with the big LMG. Shooting the chopper with the chopper. 
That's a good one, Ferg. Very good. <laughs> Isn't he so clever? We love our Ferg. Yeah. <laughs> okay, buddy. I would be getting out of there, dude. I'm not trying to waste meds on the zone. Any at all. No shot. He needs to pop yeah. it out and pop that snowboard. Bikes. Get out of there as soon as possible. I, I wonder where that other player went. <laughs> oh. I mean, it doesn't look like he has another adrenaline, so he's really wasting his health. Going down from the 150. Straight down to 100. Well, it looks like they're going to get out of there, yeah. or at least I think so, unless they get caught mm -hmm. trying to rotate. But yeah. now to Bobby. We saw Sun drop yeah, early after some shaky them. shots, nice. but Sun did get back help. into it. A knock Speaking there again, Bob, caught. Looking for the second. Vehicle coming as well. I think Marshy's just going to dip from that. There's another team here as well? What is going on? Everybody's here. <laughs> we thought it was going to be a passive game. It's not looking like it. Well, not look how many people are still in it, too. Like, there, there's only yeah. one team that's been knocked out. Oh, no. On the, the death machine here. You don't want to face that gun any at all, guys. Trust me. No shot. That just calls for an instant death. Does it hit like a truck? It does. <laughs> And then if you hit them with the truck as well, it's exactly. it's over. <laughs> Double death. Uh, well, yeah. Maybe we'll get back to Noah and see if he's able to actually get into a fight with that. But to Aerith and Nikki, we go for now. Just I don't spotting. even see him. Where's it? Oh, there he is. The airborne players. They're they're scouting for Aerith. They both went to opposite angles in the air, looking around for where they are. If they land on them, it could be a nice kill because they're split up. I think we're having some pushes to the airdrop here. Everyone everyone wants to get those load out right now. Oh yeah, three separate teams. Yeah, my boy chilling in the back. <laughs> yes, sir. Very, very comfy. I wanna, I wanna see my hog go with the godly shotgun plays again. They're entertaining. He's got two adrenalines as well. He's stacked. Level three armor, two adrenalines. It's shotgun, AK. Right Bikes. There's a sniper up on the very tallest mountain to his right, though. On the east side. You can see it on the mini-map. He's looking up. He mates marked it as well. They could sneaky-deaky their way the whole way up and catch them by surprise. That could be catastrophic. We'll see if they I get they spotted. They're starting, to, they're starting to work their way up. Yeah, they jumped off. I'm not sure if they were spotted. Oh, they got the airborne. This is going to be they're good. They're going to be there. My Hulk's got the shotgun for the close range. He sees him right at the zip line too. Oh, he's going. Oh, it's like an eagle. Look at it, his prey. These guys are confident, man. Jumping in marking. on a team like this. He's marking. Oh, he's going for it. There with, he goes, with, they're there. With the uh, shotgun hello? too. Oh, oh he's no. Will it play he out though? Will it play out? Oh, oh he missed shots. Dupito clutched up though. Yeah. He clutched it. My hog, I mean, that was kind of yeah. dodgy from you. He was like the sacrificial lamb there. Like they were both just so focused on him. His teammate able to yes, sir. get the shots in from behind. So they'll stay up. I think I saw that Sun was out of the action again. So Bobby trying to get him back. We'll have to keep an eye on that as they're obviously in a good position to maybe take this whole thing if they can continue on. Exactly. I think we're going to be hopping on board with Team 6, which is Bobby and Sun. Hopefully, I think Bobby at this point might have Sun back in the game. Yeah, definitely should be. It's been a while. I thought, right I thought maybe he dropped yeah, again. Okay, okay. So he's yeah. he's good to go. All right, all right. I thought I know he got him back in once. I thought when I saw the yeah. scoreboard and him cross out that maybe he was out of it. But all right, so he's back. Yeah, me in. too. I can well, action. That bodes well, but they only have one kill, whereas they probably had seven at this point. <laughs> going yeah. to go. So yes, sir. a little bit slower, but as long as they can get deep into the game, get a handful of kills, they it might be all right. right. But I mean, well, I say that, but it also depends on the citrus on side the of things. Airboarding away. Spotted the chopper. Things are ready in flames. They're gonna oh. jump. Oh, he gets him. The battle's last alive in the duo. They're gonna chase him down on the airborne. This is gonna be a beautiful kill if they can get it off. I think, they went, I think he went to one of the houses. I don't think they spot him. Oh, I don't think they know where he went. I'm pretty sure he went into a house, though. Quite positive. Looks like Noah and Citrus are around a team again. They're chilling with Mod6 and King Gamer. Noah, Looking to frag them the, out. Still on the machine oh, gun around here. the rock. He's trying oh. to get him. I, I would have honestly hopped out. Both of them hop out on that guy yeah. and go for it. 
get a single frag and then skirt off. Oh no. Differently. Going into the final yeah. here. I think you might be right, Kyle. They're trying to play a little bit more passive, secure right. their number one spot. Like, they're already 20 points ahead. If they die early, it could be awful. They've been driving off around for a minute now, so that's definitely mm -hmm. planned. Mobility's yeah, like, great in this game. They just, like, they're praying for teams to drop, right? Just like, exactly. We have, so wait, yep. I have, like, a team or two out of it, but for the most part, the lobby stayed really healthy. Definitely. And I think they're blowing stuff up so that no other team can use it because vehicles in this game, they have a lot of health. So you can stay in these vehicles for a long time and just ride around and not really have to worry about it too much unless you go against somebody with an FHJ. But really, nobody's been using the FHJ other than Sun and Bobby. Yeah, that's interesting to see here because I thought there would be a lot more FHJ usage seeing that people 100%. are just traveling around in vehicles. But maybe we'll yeah. see some in the end. It's getting down to crunch time. Right now, everybody's going to be going at it. I just seen Noah get knocked and Bobby get full killed. Oh, no. Another knock on the little B. My Hawk shotgun guard able to use the AK to his advantage through the smoke bomb. Gee, Noah got full killed as well. Oh, no. Not looking good for either Su Sun and Noah's team. The bounty is working, well, no, guys. Sun and, Sun, and Bobby are both, Sun and Bobby are both dead. No, Sun's still alive. We're looking oh. at him right here. Behind the wall too! Oh, they both they both try to grenade each other. That was a good grenade by whoever he's fighting. Straight on him. Yeah, yeah. Would have been great I if he got the whole kill though. Got a 1v2 situation here. We do indeed. Sun's out of there though. He's not having it. I'm sorry, oh, no. son. I thought you were I thought you were dead, but you're not dead. I still <laughs> believe. <laughs> Good job, son. That was good. He sh he needed to get out of there quick, and that's exactly what he did. He just dipped on the snowboard. I would have done the same thing. He was on board with my hawk. Is he oh. gonna get the kill? He smoke bombs it straight away for the for the wall hack. Oh. Come on, my hawk. We want to see that shotgun action. Pump time. I completely agree. Pump time. Oh, oh. This is bad accuracy, oh. but he might be able to clutch it. Oh. Vito cool. got him. They got him. His teammate with had a shotgun. shotgun. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of people still alive. Yeah, 24 left, in this bro. zone yeah, is insane. Sun's still bailing around on the snowboard. Just trying to stay alive at this point. He doesn't... Does he have Bobby's tag? I don't think he does. He doesn't. He, but Mod 6 and King Gamer are covering... Oh, oh, no! Right oh, into him. Oh, my God. What They're a kill. Officially out. Completely Bobby and Sun have been eliminated. The question oh, no. is, are Noah and Citrus still alive? Uh, Citrus I was. I believe it's just Citrus, and he's on clutch number 42. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good for Citrus. Take Ooh, I thought that was Tectonic on the kill feed, but it was Titillo. We'll have to keep an eye out for Tectonic and Kublai as well, as they were really high up in the leaderboards. Also, they've spotted a team over to the side. My Hulk is insanely aggressive with his teammate. That is something we have not even talked about. They just push absolutely everyone. As soon as they spot a team, they're straight in. Every well, they're time. Lead, they're leading the way this time. They, they have six kills. What, a team has four? And then oh, nobody else has really done a lot? Yeah, they're pushing. pushing. I think the they're top just trying, teams to are trying to play way, passive. Way up to the... Yeah. Um, on the leaderboard here. 100%. Looks like a fight's going down here in the Ooh. middle. Hawks is knocked already. Hawks is knocked already. <laughs> I think they got all Hawk of them. was not ready for the bald god. <laughs> not a chance. <laughs> not a chance. I can hear a car in the distance coming close though to Mod 6. Is he going to get run over? No. They're really close in the minimap if you look. I wonder who that is. They're trying to stay alive. I know that much. It's Citrus. They don't want the smoke. Citrus. It could be Citrus. Look at all those adrenalines. Oh, that's what you want to see. Well, this is... I mean, it's interesting because Citrus and Noah are both up, but they only have one kill. Yeah. And they were, what, first coming into this, but yeah. I, I don't yep. know if a team has, like, enough kills to kind of overtake them. Someone, I yeah, mean, there's it's going to have to be, like, there's a good Tectonic. There's a yeah, good Tectonic's team did, but I don't know where they are right now. Yeah, nice. Oh, got some ninja action by Bougie. Yeah, My boy is using the way. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the ladder, dude. That's a one-way ticket to hell. 
some more. That were some really good shots right there. He got him really weak. I wonder if they're gonna push. Hopefully. I would like to see a push right here. Ninja's coming out. Oh. They're going in from multiple different angles. Yeah, Shotguns yeah, yeah. landed. It's, it's over for that guy. I'd be pushing that. They need to push it right now together. A little bit of teamwork oh. action. Mod 6 goes down. It's all down to King Gamer. Yo, yo, take that first, man. They're in the zone, though. It's doing a lot of damage. I believe it's nine per tick. Mm. Teammate's yeah. blocking his way. Get in. Nice. Snowboard, right? Oh, no. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, no. I did not know you could climb that. Oh. I thought he was screwed right there. He's not able to get his adrenaline off yet. They're going to be fine. Trying to get into the game. Course, they're trying to get out. Yeah, well, yeah. It, what do you mean they're going to be fine? They're trying to scramble out, but there's also so yeah. many teams here. Oh, on yeah, end. that is a team. Driving around in Bertha. I had no what? idea. Uh, look how small the circle is. There's still 18 people in this oh tiny little zone. God. Oh, my God. So much this zone is, damage for Nevada. Is, oh, my God. There's so many teams. To the zone. Oh. What are you doing? Get to Nevada's the zone. Nevada's going to die inside of the zone. He got the kill, but he's dead. Bushy's dead oh as well. The team's going. Jokes to also go inside. I thought they would have kept pushing. All falling. I think at least four teams just died right there. Eight players out. Godsley died as well. Valor's out. Their team's gone. Yeah, we just went from 18 to 10 in like five oh, seconds. Nine. And now resume is gone as well. Envoy able to pick up the kill. And level three armor. And a lot of loot. Nine people left alive. Is Citrus the person still going around in this birthday right here? I'm it telling is. you. He's I'm in his little you. Jeep. Yep, that's all he needs to do, dude. Free game, they were like, and just going to drive around. <laughs> They are still alive. They could, if they clutch up right here at the end of this game, that could be insane with kill points. But they need to take Citrus Ice ASAP because if he gets good placement points, it could be over. Do you think we're going to have a push here? Hopefully. It's kind of looking like it. Uh, I hope so. I hope Tectonic and Kubli clutch up here and get a ton of kills because that would make the standing super close. That is true. I don't think it's happening, though. Because... Yeah, I don't know if Citrus oh. and Noah got any kills oh. in that sequence. Oh, no, it's back. Oh. It's Noah. He, he got slid. Noah. He collected Citrus. his 250. Let's go. Last alive on he Team 5. I don't know why Citrus didn't jump out there. He could have confirmed that kill. Got another one onto the board for the Team He's 5. He's still driving Ooh. around. Let, he let, is. He's doing his thing. Too he fast. Is, too furious. Dude. Citrus is flying. I think Noah 100%. said no matter what, don't stop. Just keep driving. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. The team strats. Oh. Oh, I mean, the more people fight, the more placement points Kublai they get. Is down. Kublai got another. Is that Citrus right there? Citrus. Yes, it is. He's dying. Take Tonic and Kublai clutching up here towards the end of the game. There's only four, five people left. Marshy's still yeah, alive. Huge. Kublai could be killing yeah, King Gamer. Oh, oh, I'm not sure. But hopefully a lot. Here? Oh, no. A 1v1v1 1 1 1 third party coming in right now. It's just like how it started with game one. Three exactly. Left up. Oh, he had to reload. He snapped on him, but did that bullet <laughs> okay. No. Is Tectonic going up? Tectonic. I think he's going to go for the third party right here. Marshy just killed King Gamer. It's Tectonic and Marshy in a one v one situation. Let's Both go. players on the NA Regional Finals Championship Let's roster. Go. And Tectonic clutches it up. Marshy, RIP in the chat. Oh Marshy. no. <gasps> Hold up. Hold up. They. They it's gotta be close. Up massively. They might have gone up so much because you just didn't get very many points at all. Look, exactly. it was nine points for Noah and Citrus. Sun and Bobby died God knows how long ago. Like, they didn't get any points. Everyone that got points in the game five was people not really in the hunt that much. So I have no idea what the standings are gonna look like. I have no clue. It's gonna be yeah. so close between Noah and Tectonic's team. That's why I said it was gonna be They were be 20 or so points ahead and Tectonic just finished 20 or so points Wait, what was the, ahead what was this the game. What was it was the like 20, 20. I don't know how much it was exactly, but it was 20 something. And they yeah. just got 20 something more points than them. Yeah, this could it, be huge yeah it's going to be around. It could be around a tie, like somewhere in that ballpark. Oh. I don't know. But but that was like the ideal scenario for the teams. Exactly. Trying to come from behind. Like the big boys going out first as we look through what everybody earned throughout the course of that riveting final game five. Kyle, we haven't seen the exact standings yet, but what does your gut tell you? Who do you think took it? All right, okay. I'm just, I'm just trying to wonder if um, Noah and Citrus gathered enough points to like. I, I don't know. Through. It's, it's tough. I, it's tough. It's tough. But they, given that they only got nine. Yeah, given that Kublai clutched it up and they got the win, I think, I think there's a good chance that they may have passed Noah well, and Citrus. It, it, it's one of those situations where it's like frustrating because like they played they played hyper aggressive and dropped in their spots the, the like for all the games they tried to mix it up and play a little bit safer and i'm wondering if that's just like not their thing yeah like, I, they definitely switched up the game plan and we saw that it definitely did not work out for them all right well
it's tallying time. Our admins and everybody getting the points put together so we can see where this all played out. Uh, it's been a wild, wild time in game five, just like the rest before it. Insane. Let's take a look at the highlights from that magical game five. I'll get him. There, chip, there, chip. Yeah. Laser one. Oh, I got shaded though. Not nice. Good help. Good help. Good help. Good help. Good help. Absolute chopper. Nice. Ooh, got him. Beautiful, beautiful. I right, chase you. Chase you. Yeah. I'm gonna die. Got that kill. Let's go. Nice, Gotta kill before nice. we die. Let's go, bro. Oh, bro, you got this. Got it. You got that. Woo! It was the final game, and while well, the highlights told the story, what a what a sensational finish to the tournament it was but now it is the moment that you have all been waiting for a look at the final standings and my god oh what? my god uh, what what, what is, is this no way. What happens I, now? What happens? I, I actually did they just, win because they victories? Yeah, victories? that's what I'm thinking. Is that, is that the decider i just realized i have no oh idea my what the god, rules are. i have this, no idea this is super close no, it, it shows them in first, so yeah, it's got it's got to be the victories and maybe the third I mean, tiebreaker would have been the first kills. Yeah, um, they had the most kills, first kills, and the most victories. But, I think that they deserve the win. Listen, that props to Tectonic and Kublai for that run at the end. Like the fact that they moved up into you know a tie for first basically and get the second place 100%. is amazing. But Noah and Citrus, I mean, they were consistent in a in a, in a lot of things, right? Like they the, whether it was the first kills early in games, and think about like it's weird because I thought that the first kills was going to be what won it for him. Technically, that is what tied it up yep. for him. But then, hundred percent, the fact that they also had two victories to go with it, and oh, I just I just was told I was just told by one of our admins that it actually it was the overall kills that was actually the tiebreaker. I thought it would have been victories, but it's overall kills, and they led that twenty seven to twenty one. So. Yeah, well deserved. But they have the most victories. They have the most kills. They have the they have the most first kills. Like they they really they got it done in every facet of it. Amazing. I just imagine if Kublai had have killed the person that he died to in the final circle. Yeah. If he had have got that kill, they would have won. It really did all come down to the last game. Definitely interesting it, results here. I I gotta feel it for them though, Kublai and um Tectonic here because that was super close. They were just. Just inches away from that victory. Yep. But they did play a good game. If Tectonic had his gun reloaded, oh, he could have got the kill on the guy him? that killed oh, Kablai. Yeah. Exactly. It all comes down to just little small things like that. It really does. But what a what a wild finish it was. That's a dream scenario, right? It comes down to the the final kills, the final game. But I do want to take us through now. Like, what does this all mean? Uh, you saw the standings and the placements of how it went down. Let's look at our hot drop heroes leaderboard though first and see who took home some of the, the extra cash for different prizes that we had. Uh, Noah and Citrus, they get first in the tournament. They also had the most first frags, which we highlighted at the beginning of game five. Citrus uh, accounted for all three of them. I mean, he was dominating. That's an extra thousand dollars on the top there, plus the $500 for each of those three kills. So $2,500 for the squad. Uh, Extreme and Totillo, they had two first frags as well to get the extra thousand dollars. And then the Kingslayer overview. So I wanted to see this who ended up kind of killing who. Um, so what? Taking out Noah was extreme, taking out Citrus was tectonic. Kublai and Bobby both went down to mod six. So my ball brother did end up getting some cash at the end of the day. And Sun dropped the extreme. So that's how that worked out as far as the you know the extra little perks that we had on the side of this, but Guys, that was that was fun. Kyle, you have a good time. Is that the first time you've really kind of come on and like commentate something like this? Yeah, this is this that, this was very fun, and this is definitely my first time, aside from when I do it on my live streams. But you know, it was really a fun experience. Like this was just this was just great, honestly. No, it was cool. I, I was happy to I was happy to work with you guys, and yeah, honestly. I, I want to see how much money how much money these guys made though. Like, let's look at the final payouts. Like, who took home a lot, a lot Ooh. of cash, right? A lot of cash. eight point five k for Noah and Citrus. That, that I mean, lit. sheesh. That is lit for them, honestly. That's not a bad day at the office, if you ask me. They came first, and they had the most first frags. Like, everything is just just looking good for them. Yes, sir. No, they, they did it all. As so we just look through kind of where it went out and uh, where the money went to. 
Um, congratulations to those players. Uh, you know, that was that was a lot of fun for me. Uh, I, you know, I casted the multiplayer for Call of Duty Mobile, but I hadn't uh, commentated the, the Battle Royale before really done this. So it's cool uh, to be involved in these events. And Ferg, Kyle, it was awesome to work with you, Ferg. Uh, any final thoughts? I mean, that was a thrilling experience. It was. As well yeah. as being awesome to work with you as well, Meevan and Kyle. Yeah. Wait, well, one last thing. I learned like an hour ago that Kyle lives in Jamaica. That's got to be awesome. Yeah, that is awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> this is like the favorite place on earth, actually. So, yeah. I bet. But definitely, guys, it's, mm. been, it's been a pleasure working with you guys. An honor, actually. And yeah, I had a lot of fun. And, you know, shout out to Cod Mobile for doing this. I hope to see many more BR stuff. Yeah. So, yeah. 100%. I think we will. I think we'll see a lot more tournaments in the future, especially on this official esports channel. I, lo I love that shout out, Fur. But uh, yeah, this has been the duo drop in presented by Call of Duty Mobile. Uh, thank you all for watching. We hope to see you all soon. Have a lovely and glorious day. Peace. Bye. <laughs>